<laughs> Don't worry. Okay. All right. Let's make sure this shows up on Twitch. OBS is showing me some some weird colors, but hey, we're here. Welcome everybody. <laughs> Currently live, streaming from this comfortable Cornell community. We're about to play some Smash Brothers. We've 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 been having tournaments. I just haven't been here for a while, you know, between Taekwondo and academia and yeah, but we're here. We're about to showcase some Cornell talent. You know, looking forward to some good games. You know, a lot of cool players are here. We've got Octop, we've got JD4, you know, we've got Samu, we've got Daedalus, you know. The, the the peeps are here, we've got Wavy in the back, he's playing his game right now. Alex is still TOing, you know, if anybody wants to see what I look like, let's see. Oh, no, that's not the camera. Let's see. Alright, well, you guys now see, like, all my placeholders. That's okay. It's all good. But regardless, we're chilling. We're doing okay. I guess I wanted to show off my new drip because I just went to Holly. That was pretty cool, but the camera isn't working for the face cam, so I might have to set that up later. But yeah, I hope yeah, sure, everyone's doing okay. We have Sensor and Lucas on stream. Alright, Sensor and Lucas. Let's go. Alright, there people are deciding things real quickly. But how's chat doing? You know? how, how are you guys? I... Bola and Salmon. Sure hope the stream is Salmon. looking okay. I've been doing a lot of experimentation. But yeah, for now we're chilling. Oh yeah, I got you. Um, did I put it in my book? Oh, oh here you go. Alright. Here, we're on the live stream, and this might not look good in the archives, but I'm curious why the solo cam isn't working. Just let it hmm. Typically, the front facing camera, right? Oh, there we go. <laughs> I'm here, it just needed to be activated. Yo, but how are you guys doing? Yeah, I'm, I'm all dripped out in colors, you know. I got to go play Super Mario Color Splash on my Wii U, and then Reggie pulled me into the Wii U, and wow, here I am. Not just kidding, it's Holy today, so happy Holy for those who got to throw colors. Although people throw them at different dates, so it's cool. Oh, but we've got some gameplay that's about to take place. We've got Octop and Alex, or less than three. Oh, what was it? Oh yeah, the camera is pretty good, yeah. Camera is all good. Oh wait, actually move a little bit more to your right. There you go, all good. Okay, all good. Ah oh, yes, of course, welcome. All right, here we go. So now I'm gonna quickly set up the names real quickly, see what's happening. All right, so we've got Octa versus less than three. I do wonder what characters they're gonna play. I assume it's gonna be Sephiroth versus Zero Suit. But that's gonna be... He doesn't play Zero Suit anymore? Oh my goodness. What What is happening here? All right, I'm gonna assume this is winners round one. Let me check the bracket and see. All right, this is winners round two, actually. That's pretty hype. Oh, they're choosing music too. Oh, Tekken? All right, all right. Let's go. So what, what, what are we listening to? Okay, on small battlefield. Ready. Oh, Streamlink uh, and Kikia. 
Oh, oh yeah, A N E K Y K. I'll try. I'll, I'll put it on the Discord. It will be pretty high. Alrighty, here we go. Let me put this on the full screen projector, and then I'll move this to the second desktop, and then we'll we'll do this. We'll go in between. All right, all good. Okay, no, no worry, no worry. You guys do the the stream thing, or you guys play the game. I'll, oh, thank you, thank you for posting my Twitch in the Discord channel. Man, this is gonna be an interesting replay for anybody who looks <laughs> back at it. But but it's okay. This is candid. This is taking place. So regardless, oh, we've got Cloud. What is this? Octop's playing Cloud? Well, that that's oh that's really God. interesting to me. Wow. All right, but here we go. We've got Cloud versus Pokemon Trainer. Small Battlefield. Octop versus Less Than Three. Here they go. It is a good day. At it is a good day at Cornell. Here we go. So right now, Octop right now walling with a lot of fairs. Less Than Three able to get in as Pokemon Trainer. Squirtle, you know the boy. Squirtle not taking too much damage, instead actually dishing it out, but they're playing in. Oh, the grab! Oh, down tilt! Shield! Ooh, Nair! You got that Smash 4 Nair all up in here. Here we go. Uh-oh, uh-oh, Ivysaur, hope don't be in trouble! Oh, <laughs> Throwing the Nair! Oh, there's the Cross Slash! Premium Edge with a side B. Premium Edge guarding by, by Octop with the Cloud. You know, but Lesson 3 has lots of faith in Ivysaur. You know, the up air showing so. They're back on neutral, back on the ground. Oh, they're flirting. That's a cross slash right there. Oh, but cancels the grab with the Nair into Leaf Blade. Oh, oh no, Razor Leaf. That's the move. Alright, there into Nair. Oh, into the Blade Beam! How did the Blade Beam go? I said, what a day to be a Cornell! <laughs> no, but it is a good day what to a be good a day. You know, no, let's let's commentate on our Cornell experiences that while they're playing Smash Brothers, you know. Well, what does this remind you of, you know, when, when you see these nice animated characters <laughs> playing, playing video games right It reminds now? me of video games. That is good, you know, like, who in the world would have thought we- Oh, that was quite a back air. <laughs> Nice job, nice job, lesson three. That was a good back here right there. The Squirtle's now gonna start putting in damage, putting in some, well, it's not extra credit, he's gotta catch up, but he's got this though. Oh, but that fair is gonna catch the get up attack because Cloud's F2 is busted like that. Good sword swing into Nair, backwards Nair, but gets hit by the up B, the Vine Whip, into the fair. He's got limit, I hope he doesn't do another cross slash, but less than three cancels it out. Down throw into up air. Octop not gonna die just yet. Good recovery using the side B to delay. This is good, and it's a dash attack, and that's gonna do it, pulling the Spargo to recover right there. Here we go, fair into another fair, not quite. I, I'm sure we'll see many more. Oh, the up B from less than three from little Charizard. Charizard's not little, I don't know why I said that. Here we go. Oh, Coach 213 had something to say. If my girl and Octop both drowning, and I can only save one, catch me at my girl's funeral saying Sephiroth low tier. Octop, you've got coffee pasta. Sorry, play your match, but you've got coffee pasta now. Please, my dog Bernard. That's right. My dog Bernard cannot. <laughs> ATV has said there's some frame drops. I think it'd be a good job to check the frame rate. No, you're right. There are a few frame drops. In but it's what we've got. The replay always ends up in 60 FPS, but I don't know why the stream is like this. I think it's just that good Cornell Wi Fi, if you know what I mean. Maybe I could switch to EDU room later though. Not Smash. Well, thanks for letting me know though. Smash on Edge Room. Man, that would be tough, you know. At least the Wi Fi is free now though. That's, that's, that's a good thing. Oh, oh man, that was a good yeah, that was a limit limit blade boom, I believe. Let me check the replay, yeah. Limit blade beam, that's gonna do it. So that's gonna be game one going in Octop's favor as Cloud. So I'll give him the one point there. I'll even upload the character icons. You know, bam, there we go. 
So now we know who is who. Yeah, bring it. That is cool. Thank you for joining me. The they don't put Wizard One of One characters in this game. <laughs> I don't. Wait, am I allowed to talk? Oh yes, you're good. You're no good. Welcome. Way. Welcome. You know. Are you allowed to what? Talk. Yeah, you're you're allowed to talk? talk. I didn't know. I was talk so much. Don't worry. Don't worry. We're no. We're, I was being respectful. I was learning how to it's, do it. It's it's all good. We we all have different commentating styles. Wait, you know. I need the Jacob. Please give me the link. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Thank you. I will comment and commentate. Um, oh, Zeb said, Octop fans in chat, let's freaking go. Absolutely. We're all we're all Octop fans in here. But I'm also a less than three fan. And right now, we're seeing the Ike and the Violet. This is different. Complete character switch from the second game. I hope it works out for for Octop. I hope more or less than three. I don't know. I'm not biased, don't worry. <laughs> but I hope it works out. It's interesting, they both switched characters. I wonder if it was a counter pick, but it's nice to see both of the Fire Emblem reps, you know. Violet, you know, anybody who's been watching competitive Smash has seen that. Violet has made quite <laughs> You know, we, we all played the DLC and we're all like, oh, okay, maybe Biles will be mid, bottom mid, and then Leo said, nah, I like this character, I'm gonna, I'm gonna be goaded, and he does, so that's why Biles a goaded character. But we don't see enough Ike, in my opinion, at least not as much as we used to see. Leo used to play Ike, I think, before the Joker DLC dropped, but, you know, it's, it's, it's pretty cool to see. Regardless, they're currently on their third stock. Right now, it seems that the Violet is working out very well for less than three. Right now, Ike being a heavy boy though, fighting for his friends, so... You know, he's gonna be living late. Oh, but that fair is gonna kill on the other side of the stage. There we go, so... Less than three is gonna take the lead here. Also, getting some extra credit doesn't get the side view though, but gets the up air. Into forward grab, into forward throw, forward throw into F, into fair, sorry. So here we go, they're playing footsies once again. Oh, tipper F smash! Isn't gonna kill, but goes to the other side, gets picked up by the up smash. Ike is living. Excellent BI from off top. Uh oh, down tilt. Didn't get the up air conversion though. Ooh. Oh, the ether is gonna get punished. Dang, that's a rip. That's alright. Alright, forward throw. Oh, there we go. Off top, clapping back with the up air. There we go. They're now back, fresh stocks, playing neutral once again. Yes. <laughs> so you go down throw into up air. Yes. Into ether. Let's start it. <laughs> oh, we've got some more Twitch copy pasta. I wonder who said that. I do too. Astro Mira said, Wavy. Who is Astro Mira? Isn't someone Mira? you like or dislike? Who is that? It's someone you do research on to arrive at an informed position. Yeah. The last thing you should do is get involved because of his lips or his status as the king of New Jersey. Oh my goodness, who do you think said that? The who king of New Jersey? Whoever said that actually it does make some really good points. I agree actually, mm, very mm, strongly. Mm. I can't wait to I see mean, uh, Wavy. Um, Wavy with his big lips. <laughs> and Wavy with the, the, the big lips. And his New Jersey-ness. There we go, king of New Jersey. So good how do you think this head. matchup is going, my friend? <laughs> is this something? Is this what you expected? Is this how you expected it to go? Wait, who's Violet? Violet less than three. So Violet. right now less than three. Ooh, oh, that was a great fair catch, catching the jump with the fair off top. But you know, maybe or <laughs> no, we less than three just has to close out the stock and then hopefully. Uh oh. What are you doing? Sorry, how is the magic going? Sorry, I should have, I should have like answered that. That was my. No, 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 you're good. I, I was Take your time. Focusing. This is your stream. No, you're, you're a. Uh, oh, well, well, this is what you need to do. All right, less than three is going to take that game with the Violet in this Violet Ike matchup. It's now one one in the first to two. So best of three. Best of three. Here, I should upload some metadata as well. 
Cornell Munchie 47. With the right bracket you are. And it's still best of three at this point. Oh, here we go. He's pulled out the Sephiroth. Ooh, now we're talking. <laughs> so now it's Violet versus Sephiroth. Dang, I hope this goes well for him. <laughs> oh man, yep. So, for those who don't know the world, but the Cornell community, the Sephiroth has been a menace. A menace throughout Cornell and some of upstate New York but off top chooses to participate but less than three he's been playing the game so hopefully he's grown and this is gonna be an exciting match so far going pretty well pretty even oh Octo Slash into fair he was expecting a back air there but you know it's up to off top all right right now they're trying to wall each other out with very well spaced moves Oh, edge guarding with the down B. That would have been quite the clip. Quite the clip. I would have clipped that personally on my side. But <laughs> that's okay. Oh, that would my have goodness. Be a clip. I agree. Then, that would be a clip. The down smash going to take the first stop. So Octop is on to the lead. Still keeps the wing. I really don't know the rules for that, but maybe he can explain it to me later. How you know you hear. Oh, fully charged Octo Slash. That's going to do it. All right, the wing has gone away. Sephiroth is no longer perceived in perceived danger, so he's gonna be edge guarding. Oh my Whoa. goodness, the Violet Spike! Oh, that's exciting. Whoa. That, that, that's pretty crazy, you know. Wow. I, I only see MKLeo did it, but but I got to see less than three do it at my very own local. Support your local tournaments, ladies and gentlemen. Support your local. No! No, that was tragedy. But we still support our locals, though. If only upbeat into stage or something, but it'd be tough. Alright, we got Nairs. Alright, Octop, Nair. Side B, back throw, back air, Nair, Octo. Okay, was, no! Oh no! Why did he do it? Why did he do it? We've got a last stock game three situation, everybody. Oh my goodness, Nair into. Oh, spot dodge into fair? Alright. Is this is gonna be a huge upset? Yo, let's go! All right, Violet versus Sephiroth. Hollow Bastion going for the dare, but gets caught by the up air. Here we go. We've got the Giga Flare, but it's a fake out into the nair. Another Giga Flare, but it's caught by the fair. Oh my goodness, Uppy! Oh, into a counter up air, but nothing hits. All right, we've got Jab. Octop's taking the stage. He is guarding. He is mixing. But Violet dashes out with the dash attack. They're on stage. They're playing neutral. Oh. Dash attack. And that's going to take it. That's going to be game three. Off top. Less than three. Everybody applauding because that was an amazing game. That was a hype game three. That was, that was pretty incredible. From Scotland. From Scotland. That, that could have been a very big upset in our bracket. But off top will move on. Less than three. Still in the tournament though. He's just on the loser side. He has to do twice as much work, but he did a very good job. That was that was an incredible match. Here, Twitch, would you like to get a look at your commentators? Here, here, would you would you guys like to be on stream? I got you. Here we are. We're all chilling. We're all talking, watching the Smash Brothers. It's a good time. So happy to be here. You know, it's it's a good time. We're all chilling. We're all on stream. We're on camera. Hey, everybody. Life is good. This is really cool. All right. So, what's the next match on stream? Oh, I guess I will never know. <laughs> I'm just kidding. All right. So, Alex, what's the next match? Wavy versus Adalis. Oh man, this is this is pretty good. This is gonna be really good. Wavy versus Adalis. I one thing about me is I'm gonna root for not Jacob. All right, we've got Wavy versus Adalis. 
Oh my god. What? Alright, All right, well, we, we people are hyped for this match, ladies and gentlemen. This is what we're here for. This is indeed this is what we're here yeah. for. This is why I came to Cornell. Wow. There we go. This is why I got here. We got the way we hype train right now with me on the commentator side. History All books good. will be written about, about this. this moment. Yeah. About this moment. It's about to be an incredibly hyped set. So let's see, I'm expecting some Mr. Mario from Wavy. Natalie. Let's see, I'm expecting some Mario. But it depends on who he feels like playing. We could see some Falco, we could see some Terry. He's just a really good player, so this is gonna be a pretty explosive match. You know, hey, I'm uh, expecting to Terry from Daedalus, no, but he's been say. warming up the Falco recently, so we'll see. Maybe we could get surprised. That would be pretty hype, you know. What characters do you guys want to see today? In this uh, do I want to see matchup? Wavy play? Who do you um, want to see Wavy? I want to see Wavy switch it up. I want to see some Link. I want to see some Link. Okay. A Link for... Yeah, I was about to say... No. Give us what we want! There we go. Alright, they're, they're bumping Mario. fists. So we've got Purple Mario versus Black Terry. Here we go. On PS2, my favorite stage. That's gonna be hype. Alright, they're going. They're playing Smash Brothers now. Alright, here we go. Alright, so we got Wavy. We got Deadless. We got Terry. We've got Mario. The up air combos are already on deck into back air. Claiming center stage. Alright, Terry, nice parry from Daedalus. Oh, into that whole grab combo into up B. That was a quick 45, 44% right there. But Wavy still has the lead. Oh, into forward throw. Back throw. Edge guarding. Splash. Deadless conserving resources. Still has the jump. Uses the power dunk. But does it make it back? That was close. So Wavy will take that first stock with the premium edge guarding using Mario Dash Attack, which is quite a broken two frame. If if oh jab lock jab lock, okay jab lock into forward smash, catching the jump with the neutral B. Uh oh the fireballs. Uh oh, almost got the ledge trump there. Okay now Deadless just trying to take this last stock, take the first stock. Got the jab combo, but didn't into the... <laughs> I forgot his side. That's okay. But he's got Ghost Sauce, so... Hopefully he uses it to take the stock. Uh-oh! Oh, Magnet Hands from Terry. Very nice. Into Rising Tackle. That's gonna be it. That's gonna be Wavy's first stock. So stock count is even, but... Wavy currently has plenty of extra credit. But... Terry's... Deadless got the ghost sauce, currently using it. Wavy trying to bait to roll in with that up smash. Uh oh, we've got two RUOKs on deck. Now this is pretty hype. All right, here we go. Oh, the up smash catch is gonna catch the tech in place. There we go. Up throw into down air, into fireball, but that would be a custom combo right there. All right, down throw. To okay, forward, forward air? air. This, is, this is quite the tech chasing. More far balls. Yeah. Far balls yeah. Into power dunk? To up air? Into forward air? She's yeah, wait, it. Wind is throwing yeah. the yeah. kitchen sink yeah. right now. Uh oh, up air, up air, up air. That into flood! That's the first time I've seen a Mario end the combo that way. Oh, and it works for the sake of edge guarding. Fiddle's gonna come back. Terry's gonna make it back onto stage. Using the premium auto turn around, catching back air forward tilt. Edge guarding gets the power wave. Alright. Makes it back to stage with rising tackle. It doesn't snap to ledge. Oh, ledge trump back air! And that's gonna take the stock, gonna take the game. So, maybe we take game numero uno. Not the turns. Pretty exciting, you know. This is the funny thing. Yeah. This is a lot of like broken <laughs> stuff I had to say for <laughs> Mario, you know. This is our, our resonant. Oh, it's like the using the cape to almost guarantee 
um, guarantee ledge trumps along with using the dash attack as a good two frame. Yo, Zed, <laughs> thank you. That's the wavy classic. It is the wavy classic indeed. Yup, but they're gonna run it back. They're not running it back to PS2 though. They're going to small battlefield, the slightly smaller and more compact version of PS2. But it's a nice style. You get the battlefield aesthetic, and it's kind of just so pretty, much you know. To say about small battlefield. No, absolutely. No, like <laughs> it, no, but but honestly, if we go back and just look in the background, right? Like, what's going we'll, on? We're, we're gonna watch the match, but look in the background. Look at the waterfalls, right? Somebody had to. Agent to give me a tour. No, that was <laughs> I, I, I would appreciate that. I would appreciate that a lot. You know, someone had to hand draw all of this. And, you know, one one spent hours drawing it, and now we spend hours playing it. Huh, I wonder how that works. <laughs> anyway, back to the game. They're currently on the first stock. High percent tied at 107 percent. Uh oh. Mario back throw isn't gonna kill yet. He's going deep for the flood. Daedalus with great research management, but catches the roll in. Wavy with the up smash. So that's gonna be the first stop. And now he's gonna try go for all that extra credit right now. But playing safe and neutral because he doesn't want to lose the stop too quickly. Down throw into up air. Uh oh, the platform's right there. But Daedalus SDI is out. Doesn't get caught by the next up air. That was a worry somewhere. That platform was. That could have been way more up here than. Oh, here we go. He falls out the power dunk. Good SDI by Wavy, I think. That was nice. All right, another power dunk. All right. Headless. Right now, they're playing careful neutral. Right now, rising tackle. That's going to be it. It is right now two stocks to two. I would say that the Wavy's got the advantage, but the ghost sauce is going to say otherwise. He's right now on the edge with, you know, Rage up, Go Sauce, Terry, and just as I say that, that's gonna be the second stock. Terry Deadless making the comeback right there with that stock taking. Power Geyser, that's a pretty hype move. He still has the Go Sauce, he still has the Rage, 42% right there. Wavy's gonna have to take this stock as soon as possible. Oh man, the li oh catches the get up attack or the get up jumping aerial with the up smash. Mario backward up smash is pretty wild. So now they're back with a one stock tie and you know Daedalus is gonna have extra credit due to that amazing series with the ghost sauce. That was, that was incredibly hype but that's not to count Wavy out of this you know like Mario shenanigans. You know, the edge guard. Uh oh! I was about to say edge guarding, and now this is off stage, but no, he's back. Power dunk! That is gonna do it right to the corner, and that's gonna be the game for Deadless. My goodness, so it's gonna be 1 1 in this set. Alright, Astro Mira said period. <laughs> Dang, but period to what? You know, what, what, what was the sentence? I wonder what was said. But, but that's okay, you know, we got period, you know. Maybe, maybe Astro Mira meant that, you know, the match, period, it's up to the next one, you know. We're gonna end that sentence, we're gonna start the next sentence right here, right now. Game three. Game three. Game three. Best of three. So, this is the best of three. Here we go. They are gaming right now. Alright, oh, they took it back to PS2. One of my favorite stages. It's, it's a good stage. Yes, too. Here we go. So Wavy was able to. I assume Wavy counterpicked the PS2 as he was as he won the first game here. But I'm also sure Daedalus is comfortable here as well. It works out either way. You know, two platforms to the side, open middle, plenty of neutral. Speaking of neutral. First off, projectiles hitting the Pokeball. That's pretty hype. Make, it would make a good screenshot, in my opinion. Alright. Daedalus going for the edge guard. Jabs on shield. Power dunk gets caught by the grab. Up throw. Up air into four there, but four there doesn't hit. Oh my goodness. That was. That was. Oh my goodness. You know, he read a book of like. Dang. Oh my goodness. He's going for smoke. 
he got the fair off stage, but Diddleus is gonna return to stage, you know. Unfortunate air dodge, I had to say right there, you know, because he just charged F smash, and F smash is hit regularly by like, the charge right there, that's, that's gonna do it. So now Diddleus is gonna want to take this stock as soon as he can <laughs> to keep things competitive, but honestly with Terry's Go Sauce comeback factor, you know, I, I, I think he can come back anytime he wants, but I'm sure he prefers sooner rather than later. Forward throw from Wavy. Pressuring shield gets caught by the power wave into rising tackle. That's gonna be the stock. It's now 2-2, so we're now in a similar situation as the as the second stock of game two, where Deadless was able to completely take it back with the power of go. Wavy is going to try shut that down while he can, but it's already in motion. The are you okay move, it's so good. I bust the wall. <laughs> Alright, he's going for it again with the down tail. He got the jab, but he didn't follow it up. Alright, Wavy's going to do back throw. Go for the edge guard. Nice power dunk by Daedalus, mixing up the recovery. Power dunk on stage, into spot dodge, into Buster Wolf! It's gonna take the stock. We're playing spot dodge simulator all up in here. Oh man, and it's a similar- Oh, he didn't roll in, but gets caught by the back air. Amazing tech chasing by Wavy. We're in game three, stock three, last stock. What a scenario we are, they're playing neutral. Right now, Deadless is taking a lot of credit, taking the lead right now. Oh, maybe Mario shenanigans. What will he do to make this up? Oh, uses the upbeat out of shield. Very nice. Gets caught by the dash attack though. Deadless going for some edge guarding. Gets the dash attack. Gets caught by the throw. Up airs. Uh huh. Back air though. But it starts the washing machine. The blender. No wait, but they're back on stage. The appliances, they are back on stage. Oh, jab combos, rising tackle. Oh, good DI oh, by Wavy, he's gonna live. Will he live another? I don't know, but good on his part. He is living, he is kicking. Who wants it more? Who's gonna take the last stock in game number three? Wavy versus Deadless on stage. PS2, spot on his F smash, power dunk. That's gonna take the stock. Incredible match. By Wavy versus Devilus. That was incredible. incredible. That was what a day. That was what great a day to be a Cornell student. What a day to be a Cornell student indeed. Honestly, that was that was incredibly hype. Oh my goodness. Great match, you guys. That was cool. Mm, good match. Oh, that was hype. <laughs> Not not too much else to say about that. That was just straight hype. Congrats again. That was a good match. All right. So, Deadlist is gonna move on to winners round four. I think that's actually gonna yeah be so that's gonna be winners quarters in our bracket. <laughs> no, it's not. It's actually winners semis. Well, Alright, like so... Okay, so we just actually finished Winner's Quarter. <laughs> That's funny. Alright, so... Deadless is gonna... Oh, Deadless is gonna move on to Winner's Quarters. Or Winner's Semis. Wavy, he's still in this. He's just gonna be on the loser's bracket. He's gonna have to do twice as much work. But, he's got this. It's some hype Mario gameplay. You know, thanks for letting us comment. Hey, no problem. Thanks for joining us. It was nice. Take care. Oh my goodness, Octop versus JD4. Yeah. Oh man, so we have entered winners semi-finals. Oh my goodness. All right, so we got Octop versus JD4. <laughs> that was an incredible set though. That was good stuff. <laughs> Alright, Octop versus JD4. Here we go. They're about to face off Octop, you know. The the best Sephiroth at Corel. <laughs> really, really good Sephiroth. Just like pretty insane. And then JD4. You know, jack of all trades. Man literally mains random. <laughs> it's actually insane. 
But I wonder if he's gonna choose a character today. That'd be pretty hype. He is gonna choose a character. <laughs> Dang, this is hype then. JD4, as talented as he is, is gonna choose a character today. Yeah, that's hype. Okay. Well, let's see. JD4, move a little bit more to the left just to be on camera. <coughs> Alright, well, okay, they are playing. So we've got Greninja. Alright, so we've got Greninja versus Wolf. That took me time. Sorry, I'm tr I have to type all of this. Alright, anyway, best of five winners semi finals. It's, it's hype. So let's see how this first stock is going. Oh, the scores are definitely not higher. It's still 0 0 right now. Alright. JD4 with the shiny Greninja versus Octopus Wolf on PS2. How did Wolf get to Pokemon Stadium? Honestly, it's hard to tell, but forward smash, and then it's gonna be answered by back air, respectively. Then they're on two stocks apiece. These games go fast. This is pretty incredible. So now let's see how their neutral interaction is gonna be. Greninja is really fast, so he's gonna play some Scrappy hit and run neutral. Somewhat similar to Sheik, but then Wolf, you know, it's he's all around well rounded, good neutral. Maybe somewhat exploitable recovery, but generally, Wolf is doing a good job getting back to stage. So let's see how this they navigate this matchup here. You know, oh, gets caught by the laser. And then laser again. Wolf gonna go for the low hit. Right now they're just playing like ultimate, you know. Jumping, landing on shield, and then jumping out of shield again. Oh my god! That's the side V clip. Oh my goodness, into spike. But But if but if anybody wants to check out that video by Void, you know, on how to play Smash Ultimate or something like that. You know, the, the leapfrog frog scenario, it's, it's pretty cool, I have to say. Ooh, let me see. Oh, we've got some insight from Zed at home. Let's see. He said, oh, no, I know I'm top is heated about this Greninja thing. Yeah. Greninja, I have trouble playing against Greninja. It's like hit and run, scrappy. How to get a hit in when a character's back with you? Now, let's see, has 34 went Greninja the whole random? I have no clue. I have to ask him about that after the whole set takes place. But I believe as of now, oh, now Eftil is going to take it on ledge. One of the best ledge guarding options, as um, Charlie the King says. Well, let's see, so Octop is going to take that game. I know. <laughs> oh, so Octop's gonna play Palu? Palu Tana versus Pit? No, versus Dark Pit? This is a canonical matchup! <laughs> what stage did they go? Yo, you flew. This is this is a canonical matchup. I wish they went to a canonical stage. That'd be pretty hype. <laughs> so, so dark day, you know. Well, I didn't play Kid Icarus Uprising, so I don't know the complete lore of Dark Pit, but maybe Dark Pit had enough. Oh, that charge down smash, but isn't gonna kill quite yet. They're doing it, okay. So off top, gonna hit that down tilt into back air. That, you know, the, the values no one love. Down throw into up air, and that's gonna kill at a fresh, well, at a fresh 114%. And then Palu's only at, well, 80 right now. Alright, forward air by JD4 into arrow. Alright, oh, we got a nair from Palu into up air, into up air! Oh, the back air right there could have been something. <clears throat> Dash attack. 
Ooh, the upper dash arm or the electro style or the electro shot. Well, that's what he says, right? <laughs> Using them directional aerials. Okay, catches the Nair. Forward grab Nair onto the opposite side of the stage. 84 is looking. He's, he's looking. You know, will he find it? Only time will tell, but he is looking for that edge option. Alright, let's see. Back throw from Octop. Into back air. The power back air. Oh, but then the, the clap back with the dark tip back air. Gonna kill. So right now they're at 0 0, but Palu's gonna have the stock advantage. Octop with the whole stock advantage right now. You know, JD4 ought to change it up. But I'm sure he's got this. Alright, going back to stage, he gets in there. Oh, triple spot dodge. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I love spot dodge. It's one of those weird things because we always say, oh man, you're, you're not supposed to spot dodge or roll at the upper level. But I mean, these are options that we have when we pilot the characters, you know? You know, sometimes, the, oh my goodness, Nub Smash is gonna take that neutral get up option. I didn't expect. But you know, sometimes you just have to spot dodge three times, you know? Like, three times. Three times. Hey, I know that individual. How are you doing? Hey, I'm doing a okay. <laughs> Thank you, much appreciated. Happy hold. It was, it was pretty nice. Uh, got all the colors. Are you playing today? Uh, I can't do it. Oh, okay, gotcha. How? Oh, that's okay. How's the fashion show? That's very good. That's really cool. Hey. Well, thanks for still showing up today, though. We, we appreciate it. Yeah, there we go. We playing Smash Brothers. Oh, they keep switching characters. Why do you guys keep switching characters? <laughs> All right, so we've got Cloud versus Hero. I see it's like JD4, he's always wanting, he's like, I've always seen him like itching for, for um, the Hero, but now you get to see it in action. Octop's gonna be up two games, so this is gonna be the one that JD4 is gonna have to figure out if he wants to continue to play on the winner's side. But, uh, oh my goodness, point blank range magic first. Oh, and he got the fair, so he's recharged. At least he can recover one time, but Cloud up smash, he's gonna say four, and that's and, and that's the end of that. Fair into F tilt, into back throw. Uh oh, gets caught by a tornado. He used it again! Oh no! <laughs> And then, I mean, how do you escape that? I mean, you can roll in just as that, but even catching the end of the roll in, that's a pretty insane move. And how JD4 was able to get that twice, <laughs> that is something special. Alright, wow, good edge guarding, going for the fair, but the limit climb hazard, very good. Charging it, good limit awareness. Oh wow, the, the dash attack's gonna catch the ledge. Dash attack again. JD4 has some good DI curly. Uh oh, that was a special move of some kind. I think the heavy slash. Oh, but the ice slash move? Oh my goodness! He did not limit cross uh, limit climb hazard out of ice. That was that was extraordinarily hype, you know. It's like when a hero or a villain, you know, like you know, like in those cinematic hero movies where you have an ancient evil that's covered in ice and then like they just like grab you out of the ice and they're like i'm not dead uh oh uh oh oh no oh no <laughs> what the what? that 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 was an opportunity but that's okay the the, the, the game continues <laughs> yup so J jd4 has gotta gotta pull something out of that hat but yeah. You know that, that that that's okay. That was that was that was a funny game. That was a funny game. It's always a great. It's always great to watch hero gameplay. My goodness, but that was a good game between. What? <laughs> well, 
It's really Don't cool worry. to see the cloud from Mark Top. It's nice to see the hero from JD4. That's just... <laughs> That's just the way it do. Hmm. <laughs> Alright, well... What was it? Sure! Yeah, if there's no... If, win, if winner semis isn't available, yeah. Oh, okay, yeah. Then that will do. Let's go for it. Let's see. Okay, they're playing. Alright. Oh, uh, no open matches? Alright. Well, I guess we chill for now. No open matches, so we just display arbitrary broadcast. Yeah. Apparently everybody's uh, playing the video game right now. Right, that's wild, bro. No open matches, we'll just wait. So <clears throat> we'll have an intermission, but it's not actually an intermission. I'm just talking while we watch the venue. You know, pretty comfy, I have to say. But yeah, chat. How are you guys doing, though? I see Zed is here. We we miss you up here. You know, hope you're hope you're having a good good one wherever you are and whatever you're doing. Let's see. I wonder if we'll do any more tournaments before the semester ends. It'll be tough, but it would be cool. Hmm. Let's see. I wonder maybe if we could do some trivia or something while we wait. Oh, thank you. There we go. Yeah, but now we wait. Alright, well, while we're waiting, I could read a book or something. I could read a book aloud and maybe you guys can tell me what you think in the chat. Let's see, so what book am I going to read today? Oh, I know, I'm going to read chapter 4 of Introduction to Probability, 2nd edition, by Dmitry P. Bertsikas and John N. Oh, oh sure, yeah, that would be cool. Or. Well, no, let's not interrupt the set. Yeah, that's true. We, we shouldn't interrupt the set. You know, all, all the mental. Yeah, yeah. We'll, we'll wait for them to finish, so. When somebody reports, we can queue them in. Yeah. That would be the cool thing. Oh, meanwhile, well, before I read the probability book, let's see how I'm, uh... Is it Low Tide City this weekend? Yep. Oh, man, I wonder how that's going for people. I, I've not, but... Yeah, <laughs> I'll, 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 I'll certainly watch top eight. I hope Cola didn't DQ. Oh, yeah. I oh, hope he's so. there. Yeah. He, well, he, he didn't show. He showed up at Genesis, but not yeah, yeah. You know, big fan of the man. And I head back to Atlanta. Yeah. 404 Esports. But we're at Cornell right now, so that's the way through. All right. Let's see. So let's look at this bracket. Smash Ultimate 1v1s in progress. Yeah. <clears throat> so it looks like they haven't gotten to top 96 yet. They, they're, they are taking their time. This takes in place in Texas, so it's still on the... Uh, what's the word? Oh, okay, Cola, he's still, he's still in there. So he's gonna face Suarez when... Top 96 starts. Good for him. Good for him. That's great. Alright. Oh, yeah, I guess. Oh, <laughs> Spargo versus Kirby Kid. Wonder how that's gonna go. Alright, well, I'm, I'm sure those who are watching Low Tide City will be watching it. You know, but we're here at Cornell University, about to do some gameplay. Hey, here we go, everybody! We've got a special member on communications. 
We've got Octop. What's up? Current, currently waiting <laughs> in in. I see. Zed knew I was gonna be heated about that Greninja. <laughs> yeah. I, fuck, I was so upset when he went Greninja. Oh my goodness! How how did you navigate the matchup with the Greninja matchup? Back so there? you should be playing that matchup like quite quite campy. Basically, the way I think of it is you basically treat Greninja like he's Meta Knight. He's looking for his dash. He's looking for his, like his dash attack. It's like his landing aerial, whatever, so you just have to stay around that, that zone. I got but you. I don't feel like camping today. <laughs> Understandable. <laughs> so, he, he I'm very glad he switched game. off your ninja. There you go. Well, I'm glad the match worked out for you, so now you'll be waiting in winner's finals, I see. Yep, I play the winner of Davis and Colin, so either Terry or... You tear your cloud. Potentially DDD. <laughs> oh, potentially. Or Wario. Colin's kind of just picking up from his brother. That's incredible. I didn't know Colin played Wario. Yeah, he. So, so his brother is uh, Castilia. His brother um, is like ranked in upstate New York. Oh, that's cool. So, Colin is picking up a lot of the characters that, that his brother plays. So, that's why he has the DDD and that's why he has the Wario because Castilia's recent, has recently been playing Wario. Playing Wario. Yeah. That's incredible lore. Hey, that's that was really cool. I saw him um, when I went to uh, the a regional in Albany. Um, yeah, Castillo's a really nice guy. Mm, that's cool. Nice people all I around. Gave salutations from his brother. Salutations. I like. Yeah. And he also has a Sephiroth. Colin's been picking, or not Colin. Um, Castillo's oh, been picking up a Sephiroth. Very specifically good. for Steve. For <laughs> <laughs> I understand. <laughs> because Steve is kind of uh, dominating upstate right now. Now you need Steve that are ranked, that. I believe. Oh wait, oh who's playing? Is it uh, David and Gary? Yeah. yeah. Alright, I got you guys. Alright, so we got David versus Gary. So Pikachu's versus pretty high. Pikachu? Pikachu? Yes. Oh let's go! Alright. I I Pikachu from what I've been told. This matchup's not actually that amazing for Pikachu. Interesting. But let's see how that plays. Honestly, let's see right now as they go to game one on the PS2. Let's see how it works out for them. So we got Fieri Pikachu versus David with the DDD. Right now we've got some premium edge guarding from the Pikachu, but DDD. <laughs> Oh, but the super armor didn't last till he landed. Oh, oh yeah. Or oh. on the up B. I'm on the up B, surviving the spike. And so now they're on neutral, on stage. Uh oh, it's gonna get picked up by the back. They're right there yeah. into thunder. Caught the, caught the basketball air dodge there. It's a thing. Usually that's like extremely safe option, but I guess not this time. <laughs> there we go. So oh, we got some Pikachu loops. Uh oh, the tech on the grab into forward air. Is it down tilt? Okay, they're back on stage once again. Even if you didn't uh, edge guard opportunity. Seems like uh, David has to figure out a way to deal with the pressure that Pierre is putting up with people. It doesn't seem like he's uh, spacing around all the quick options that he can just throw out. Uh, that's true. And then, like, what's a good out of shield option for DDD? Yeah, I mean, I, he doesn't really have that much. Kind of, I think he probably just wants to stay away from shielding if possible, but he gets the up to the net the stock there, and we're back to even stocks. There we go. Even stocks. Big Judo has a lot of extra credit. You know, maybe turn that into a whole extra assignment right there. Oh my goodness. Charges the F smash. And you know, it's gonna. You know, David's gonna drop shield, unfortunately. It's a combo here. Oh, misses the uh, still but it's okay. Still have the whole stock and over in percent too. There you go. Oh, yeah, you can't shield so grab bad. it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> not, as, not from that range, it's Pikachu. Mm -mm. Yeah, a lot of notes in there. Oh, we're gonna go for the Nair. Into back air. Into grab. Into up air. Oh, that was quite a trade. Ooh, and that's but... why this matchup might be a bit tough for Pikachu because Ordo, Ordo armors through a lot of the multi hits that Pikachu throws out. Multi hits. The Gordo, I assume Gordo beats T Jolt as well. I don't think it does. That's the thing. It's that, oh, um, Gordo does not beat T Jolt, but it does beat a lot of the, the multi hit aerials that Pikachu throws out. Interesting. Oh my wow. goodness, up smash getting on the other side. And just like that, it's back to even stuff. And you know, Pikachu has a lot of extra credit, but the rage on DDD. You know, I think DDD has the like, most powerful F smash in the game. Oh, oh the my goodness, this is a hard tech, yeah. Yeah, that's a hard tech guy. That, yeah. That's not a tech one it would expect. Mm -hmm. At least I would not expect. 
to that tech. A lot of a lot of players in that situation will, will also tech. If they do tech it, they'll like over tech and they'll like buffer an air dodge. Oh, yeah. So so in cases like that, what a lot of players don't don't do enough of, and including myself, is you you buffer a tech and an upbeat at the same time. So if Pikachu drags you down, then you will input the upbeat and you will recover back to life. And if you will get stage spike, then you would tech it. And it's a it's a very Nice option select like in that situation, but I don't know if it would have worked in that spot because DD's up he might have just fallen down the ceiling. Oh my goodness. But uh, game two we have to we have to see how is uh, David gonna adjust to these uh, things that here he's doing well. A lot of the pressure, a lot of these combos are it seems like he's having trouble getting out of these uh, pressure situations, close quarters situations. Uh, pressure, you know. And then Tay also taking advantage of what <clears throat> DD has to offer, which is like just those pretty much Big one-time strikes controlling the stage with Gordo. You know, man, maybe it might be hard with T Jolt and Pikachu, but just have oh, to make it work. Oh, oh my miss, goodness! Missed the recovery there, but the recovery gonna taunt? <laughs> oh man! But we have, we do know that uh, Gary seems pretty comfortable in Smash Bros. Like so that's the truth. We could see a quick comeback. Mm -hmm. But then I'm also surprised David like counterping or like. Said, he just said, run it back, you know, that, that was like, we're gonna play it on PS2. I don't know about the stages for DD specifically, but it seems like it's a pretty neutral stage for both of too. I would imagine, you know, it's not my lab, Jesus Christ. <laughs> I'm so glad it's not. Uh oh, jab block, oh, yeah. tech chase, up smash! The e Oh, that was classic. <laughs> the e classic. classic. E-Sam loves the match. Oh my goodness. I love tech chase. <laughs> I wish there was like, well, I can't say like, oh, I wish there was more bad in this game, because there's still plenty of fun. I don't know, just like, oh! oh the DD dash, dash attack. attack there, the DD dash attack. I like to say, Very nice. not just dash attack. No, it's the DD dash, dash attack. attack. It's strong as hell, but it's, <laughs> it's so slow. So slow. Only good on someone like DD. Exactly, honestly. Covers a lot of options. Yeah. It's almost like Mario T. Oh, no. Uh oh, okay, he went for it. Uh oh, Thunder! Yeah, good at the spike hitbox for the for the to even up the stocks. Mm. That's true, right now David in this runback screen pretty well. It seems like when David has a has a strong lead that you can do a lot better. Yeah, he's able to he doesn't have to be forced to approach Pikachu when he's behind, so he can wall up Pikachu a lot easier with the, the giant hammer. Mm. Uh oh. Alright, makes it back to stage. Nair's through F Smash, or well, hits Nair before F Smash come, came out. Comes into the clip there. Down to it. Down to it. Oh man, they're playing ultimate <laughs> jumping out of shit. Pull up Nair, pull up Nair. Uh oh, jab blocks! Do Don't do it again. Oh my goodness, he's taking him to the other okay, side of the stage! Okay, he learned, he learned. Oh, okay. <laughs> he learned, he learned. <laughs> he didn't roll in. Good for him. Up for Thunder? Almost. Oh, doesn't get the final there hitbox. Go. Gets caught by oh. the Nair. Good DI by Pikachu, but... Is that it? That's that it. That will be it. We're 1-1. One, one. They are 1-1 one, one on this run back. Let's see. So this is best of three, or is this just the five? This is... This is oh, this is top eight. eight. Alright, yeah. Y'all are doing, playing... Uh, yeah. Yep, we're doing best, best of five. five. Top best eight. Of five. So we're doing best of five here. So. Right. Wait, is this technically winner... Loser's quarters, or...? Loser's eights, okay. Gotcha. Alright, so yeah, the loser's quarter. Yes. Yes, okay. Oh, so it seems oh. like I'm gonna be playing um, Daedalus in Winner's Finals. Interesting. Oh, okay, Daedalus took it over Collar. I've been playing quite a few different characters today, so I'm going to. Uh, <laughs> thankfully, all of them do fairly well versus Terry. Very nice. Very so nice. I have, uh, have, a, have a bit more liberty to choose what I'm gonna do. And we see the PA switch to Falco. Oh, he did. Interesting. You think after how well game one went, they would, they might stay Pikachu, but I can see this matchup being better for for Falco than it would be for Pikachu. Honestly. That's fair. Yeah, that's fair. Because now the combo potential that exactly. Falco has can now be fully exploited as we've we saw seen 66 here. In, in one hit, and now he's converted it to 95 and quarter situation. It is insane, you know, DVD's a big hitbox into the there! Yo, we're seeing melee combos right here. <laughs> here he kinda, oh kinda my feeling himself. Really it's awesome awesome. a little bit. <laughs> there, laser! Oh, those are the shine too? The <laughs> shine too. Oh, we're just using, uh, Wi-Fi. Wi-Fi. 
Oh, Red Rover. Yeah. Thinking of changing to Edrom because like when I look back at the stream, like it's yeah, somewhat this, choppy. The stream, the stream quality is a little choppy when I when I look back at it. Yeah, that's yeah. Kind of I wish. I wish the Ethernet. Was yeah. yeah, no, like Ethernet would be the move, but but it's it's like you can still tell what's happening at all times, so it's not yeah. too bad. That's good. Because the oh, YouTube bounces on the ceiling. Oh my goodness. <laughs> <laughs> The YouTube replays then is like, oh, it's all crisp and all that 6, 60 FPS, but it's a nice cast. You know, for, for Twitch, though. <laughs> the but thank you, though. Thank you, guys, for watching it live, though. It's much appreciated. Alright, here we go. We're, up, we're back on stage. So, Falco. You know, Fieri's Falco is gonna hold the advantage. He's going for strikes. I need to respect that armor and the up I, I want to see Fury do a, do a ledge weapon so he wants to do it instead. I see, ledge Oh, the, oh he got the Oh, he wants, he wants it. He wants it back. I agree. He wants his game to be over. It's back door now. Koro killed him so early. That's yeah. the thing. But I think, potentially sub up yeah. You know, but I think, I just, I don't think the risk was worth it in that one, you know. Like yeah. He lost the stock, got caught by the border, but, you know, at least now he has the liberty to, to freestyle once again. They can take risks at the low percent. One interesting thing here that Fury could have done is he could have reflected that Gordo on the that was sticking to the stage. Could he? He could. Oh, so cool. one thing you could do is reflect it, or if you have a counter, you can counter it, and it'll give an active hitbox to the Gordo. So it'll work as like a, a small ledge trap situation. If you're oh, if you're someone like Falco, then the Gordo prevents Petey from hanging on ledge too long. It's actually quite nice. Wow. Oh my yeah. goodness. So the so, so the Gordo got reflected by Falco's shine and then and then he got hit, hit, it by back, the, hit it back and oh. it got so strong that it just instantly killed the area. Oh, you okay. can see. Oh, land on the other side. Unfortunately. And just like that, one stock to one, and it's even. But Falco with the combo advantage right now. It's the PowerPoint presentation. <laughs> it's not stopping. Let They're staying play. for extra credit right now. Let him play. The tension. Oh, that was wild. But it's 100% right there. That's that's kind of crazy. Right, but DDD shenanigans, you know. Pretty heavy stuff. Oh. oh, dang. No upbeat. Dang, that's tough. Right, so Fieri will go up 2-1 in this best of 5. You we'll have to assume that he's going to stay Falco too. Like, yeah, no that game, Other than the unfortunate Gordo that killed him I think at like 70. Mm -hmm. it's, yeah, it's, it's, been, uh, yeah. it's been fairly in his favor. But it's, it's, it's worked out. You can't count out the uh, you know, David play yet. That's true. While it wasn't his, while it wasn't Fury's favor, I think David still make a comeback here. I agree. Uh, this is this matchup is definitely doable for David and BDD. Bringing it back to PS2 every game. Nah, I love yes. this. Nah, I, <laughs> I love this, this stage. stage. It's on. It's honestly best stage. You know, you be on the stage is nice as PS2. Like, you you, you want to play? On it. That's, that's just the way it is. Alright, Raven with the core tilt. I'll piece the Gordo at it just out now. Oh my goodness, who is that I see in it's chat? Yes, Oh, yes, how are you doing? Unfortunately, I don't think Laura is able to be on the screen for you, yes, see. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Unfortunately, not, but well, that's okay. We you know, the, the classic DD covering the ledge with forward airs and up airs. Forward air. I that respect that. And oh, F smash, yep. all out. All out the landing, all the landing aerial. There we go. That's how you do it. Oh, he went straight. Didn't even go to ledge. And he's going to get a combo off of it. Oh, uh, barely, oh, barely missed it, but he's still in advantage. Gets another combo out of it anyway. Oh my god. Yeah, it seems like David is having a bit of trouble in his, in his pressure situation. <laughs> that's what we saw with the panic uh, gap there. Like, it's, it's with stuff like that, we can definitely see this turn around very quickly. There you exactly. go. Oh, right. very nice. And now we have even stocks again. Oh, is that, that was that was DDD down show, right? Yep. Yeah, he did. Uh, we did order to knock him off, and then did the down tilt. That's it. Board air. Yeah. Yeah. He's gonna try for more F smash, but he's just gonna land with with Nair. Okay, they're now playing neutral right now. He's gonna get the poke. 
surprised that David isn't using Gordo a bit more. And you know, I feel like Gordo and Inhale are, are uh, abusing a bit more, even if they're a little bit more control. But the command grab from Inhale is quite good. That's what that's what is known for. Oh, oh, the air dodge! Air dodge. Yeah. Happens. Happens. <laughs> but you can't lose composure. You know, that's, it's an ultimate classic. We can't lose composure right now. You have, to, you have to see the game through. Take it to game five because you want to keep playing, you know. Oh, oh my goodness. Is that, is that four up to us? That, that five was four, up five, <laughs> five up to us. Good combo. Oh, he's looking for this roll. There you go. One thing I think that's hurting David a lot is he's not, he's not finding his ledge traps. His ledge traps are, are critical for him. Not quite finding them, but once he if he can get those down, then I feel like he's gonna be down. Yeah, oh, oh like the that. Gordo and shenanigans! Like the whole set could be his if he keeps playing just like that. He's just doing just like there you go. Oh, guess pop by the there. Is it there? Alright, maybe throwing the Gordo out. And the same thing applies with uh, with TV Chairs and with his Falco. The, um, the Gordo there is very good against these multi hit areas. Mm. Oh, Methako taking the board and including it into the combo. Stop. This could be the end of the set. This could be David at 135%. Oh, the clank? Oh my goodness. The Gordo. Uh oh. Not gonna kill quite yet. He's gonna make it back to ledge. Yeah. Yeah. the aerial? Yeah. yeah. We're, on, we're on game four right now. Alright, Falco's yeah, gonna good. make it back to stage the back air. DDD full oh, rage. Oh, no. Uh oh, the Nair. Nair. No catching the air Gordo. It's like the okay. oh gets doesn't have to jump, what's he gonna do? Does it cover? No. Oh, almost. <laughs> that was close. Okay. So reset the ledge trap. Oh, oh no. Over Camino? Oh no! Oh. They're throwing smash oh. <laughs> That tail! Oh my goodness, it's a tie it game! Was a, it, it was is tense at the very end. Two. You see both players were very, very eager to win that match. Exactly, they wanted it. They wanted, they, it they, they wanted it, but David pushed it out. Rep game five. Hmm? Uh, I mean, yeah, I'm swing for. I'm, I'm, I'm fine with. I'm fine to play Dados right now. I don't. I don't want to. Sure. See, yeah. What is Rep? Oh yeah. So no, we winner. we definitely want to see how winners find the I I would like to. Yeah. Um, so the winner of this will play Colin. So. Okay, that would be nice. <laughs> if David wins, we could see a DDD Ditto. <laughs> DDD Ditto! <laughs> Which sounds just as funny as I think it actually plays out. But, um, Absolutely. but if Yuri wins, he might have to repeat the matchup. Mm, <laughs> that's true. So, he'll, be, he'll be warmed up. He'll be warmed up. There we go. Be Let's see the adjustments these two will make for game five. And we do see a stage. Oh, stage they play. finally switched stages after the four matches. We do see a battle from, 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 uh, from Fieri, I would assume, because he wants, he wants more. He wants to pressure uh, DD more in up close situations. And so the Battlefield being a smaller stage will allow him to do that better. So potentially the platforms being closer to the, the main stage will be better for that. You see a quick 70 come up again. Descent. Up tilt. Juggle. Oh, Gordo. Another Gordo. Oh, it's stuck oh, on the stage. Stuck. He's, he pulled oh. out the side B! Oh, what a call out! On ledge. That's, That's gonna such be a the tough first spot. Time. That's the first side B we've seen all game. F smash from Fury. Okay. That's a ledge trap. Hey, he's still in the corner. Up smash out of you. <laughs> okay. Alright, oh, Rose Tash. Goes for Intel. Now, David, you see him throwing out many more options. You know, really changing up his gameplay. Yeah, the stars from, from the landing up B. That's why if you're gonna want to punch that, you usually want to be. Oh, that's a good spot, but David can recover from there. But the stars from the up B are insurance for D to when he recovers high. Is that the edge guard? Oh, that did SD. Oh my goodness. So that was that was a trade, you know. I don't think that was the trade that Fieri would be looking yeah, it, for. He's, he's down all the stocks, but we know Falco Falcon can come back from this with 100 percent very quickly. He's already at 54. Already at 54, just needs a few more combos. But if you're David, you're you're gonna take this and run. But this is the possible reverse or not not reverse. Yeah, because yeah, yeah. 
Okay, Not quick, because it went Gary, then... Oh, and it reflected Gordon and then back off stage. Actually, the game just went back and forth. Oh my goodness! Back and it's an even game. Dang, the Falco spike. Yup, and it's even just like that once again. Oh, the idea on the down throw so to avoid the board here. Last, last game, last stock. Who's gonna take it? Who wants it more? Maybe he's charging. Oh, oh he was a scary. That's scary. scary. Falco Condo's on point right now. David's gonna come back to stage though. Perfectly times the roll to avoid the, the stars from the up B. So he's gonna come down. And now he's at 65 to 113. Up smash into the net. Almost catches. Almost had. The SS, almost almost had. catches the roll. Alright, Decordo. Back off stage and no jump. Our mid. Uh oh, oh no he didn't smash. punish the landing. <laughs> Alright, David's gonna return. Oh, almost seems to get your flex, uh, Gordo. Yeah, but the Gordo was stuck a bit too low under the stage, so it wasn't quite like, quite one play there. I tried to call out a landing with, with the up smash there. Alright, right. see here. Oh, Ooh, had, had almost the right, catches the neutral. Had the right idea. It's tense, it's tense. Right, it is Any, just, anyone's it's game. Tense. Anyone's game. DDD on ledge. Rolls in. They're back on stage. Gordo. Reflector. Oh. That was scary. Gordo into side B into okay. up air! And, and that's gonna wins. be it. Barry's gonna take the game. Great match. That's one. Three two. Three two. That is 3 2. Clutch it up. Here we it's go. Fieri. It's still good showing from David. Unfortunately, knocked out of the tournament. But yep. Fieri is now quite warmed up for the DDD. So I don't there know if go. Colin will stay on DDD. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> if he, if he does go, he does play him against uh, Fieri. But that match should be quite interesting. But I'm going to be playing on stream right now. And so I'm going to hop up. Yeah. There we go. Thank you for joining me off top. You know, have fun. Have a good match. Yep. Good. Good match. So that's gonna be David. That's David's gonna be. David is gonna go out at seventh place. Congratulations, David. All right. So let's see. We're back in the winner side. So now this is winners finals. Test the five. We're gonna see Daedalus versus Octa. Ooh, let's see. So what characters are they gonna play? They are bumping the fists. So Octop, so we're gonna see Palu versus Terry. Alright, here we go. Let's see. Oh, their profile pictures are switched. Oh. oh, that's okay. <laughs> We've got Octop versus Daedalus. Terry versus Palutena. So not too Oh, MZK, ZSS. The last comeback was MZK5GG. I I wish I knew what that means. It seems like I'm not But it was an incredible comeback, I have to say. You know, like, you know, I was able to take it at the end with, with the taco the up there. Alright, well we're at the first game of Winners Finals in the best of five for Cornell Monthly 47. Right now I'm there, Terry's Daedalus. Daedalus is Terry, currently has Ghost Sauce, so he's going. He is going. But right now, Palace caught him on the edge, that back air, that's gonna take it. So, Daedalus no longer. Palutena, I, 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 I don't know, you know. The top seems comfortable with it. Oh, the forward tilt from off top. Down throw. Alright, they lose the eyes out. Very nice. Alright, back on that show with the back throw. Into up B, magnet hands. I love to see it. But the back air is gonna catch. Oh, good tech! No! But he gets under this, he gets caught under the stage. 
because he teched in and then, yeah. The tech mechanics, it, it'd be tough to come. So right now it is three stocks to one, so up top currently having a huge lead. But the power dunk is going to take it, so it's going to be 2-1 right now, up top to do this. But however, you know, I've, I've seen Daedalus take the <laughs> you know, with, with the ghost sauce and everything, it is certainly doable. So provided he's able to obtain said sauce, which is right now, oh my goodness! What kind of tech was that? He teleported onto the He teleported onto stage, then cancelled his landing to jump to catch the up air. What a mix. That's pretty cool movement if I say so myself. So off top will take game numero uno. Dang, MG, MBG553 is gonna cook all the competition for real. Night Be Light 6, oh my goodness. MBG553, got some fans, bro. <laughs> That's cool. MGB553. I'm curious who that is. I'm gonna quickly look that up. Oh, it looks like they're playing Smash Brothers. Once again. Here we go. Welcome. They're playing Smash Brothers once again. They're now on small battlefield. Ah, it's it's our head TO. Lesson 3 on the mic. On top 1-0. Okay. They switched to Sephiroth. Yes. Oh, he did switch to Sephiroth. I do. Um, I do personally agree with that twist. Do you not have Sephiroth? In the... I do not. <laughs> That's fine. <laughs> it will be a blank character icon or two. I add him. Is there a game that finished? Or are you just looking? Okay. Yeah, that's pretty hype right now. He's with a longer sword, you just wall out a lot of the carries off pretty even. No, he came late. He came at like 430. Actually, he came late. Oh, the Giga Flare, and there it is! Yeah, we'll Yay. catch that. Rising yeah, Tackle's pretty vulnerable, at least if you don't input it. Or, mm -hmm. or don't, uh, sorry, not input it. Or if you charge, don't, uh, it's charge, it's charge. It's charge. Uh, Although I feel like Mega Flare or Giga Flare would catch that even, anyways. And, like, it catches most of the cover, Like, you have to have, like, you just have to snap onto ledge. You know, just, like, snap. But then, what even is a clean snap in this game? Oh, it's power, it's power Dunk! Power Dunk! There we no go. SDI. No, I don't know, I actually know if you get SCI at that percent, maybe not. I don't know, he's like, I think it's in down and in. Um, I believe it's up and in. Oh, up okay. okay. But they, if you up and in, they can rise and die. Oh, that's Or they can up air, <laughs> or they can whatever. It's, it's, it's basically, basically. Well, there you oh, go. My goodness, yeah. It's a that's... clean. I don't know, that wasn't zero to death, but it was. He was at zero. Octop's at zero. Yeah, Octop's at zero. So, oh Reset boy. the stocks. He said it's now two stocks to one, and that's where like the matchup experience comes in. You know, so the analyst has got the hit. Uh, okay, here we go. Landing up there. Power, oh, power dunk, but he the SDI's out. Because we're sitting right next to him. Oh, I'm sorry, sure. man. <laughs> sorry. Are you tech chasing? Alright, this is gonna go in. Alright, take it back to stage. Using the legs. Uh oh, the up air from up top. Oh, oh he went backwards the with the Octo Slash. And the B reverse for the mix up. And there we go. Then up top going for some edge guarding, but then let's get He's in go. He's in go mode. He's in go mode. Uh oh, he's, he's got, got the it. down tilt. Yeah. Got the Buster Wolf. It's this a last stock scenario. Certainly doable. Oh, absolutely. Super doable. We've seen, we've seen Terry take these before. Uh oh, but he's eager. Oh, and he needed on shield. Oh, oh my goodness. It was, I don't even know the shadow flare mattered there. <laughs> there him. Because the shadow, I think like, the shadow flare like, hit him out of like ledge. He didn't snap ledge, that's why I would say that. I don't think he did at least. Like, he didn't, didn't look snap like he did. ledge, but he, I think he would have snapped ledge in time if it wasn't for that Maybe. flare. So, but that's, that's a big dare. <laughs> it's a big dare. It's the Ar dare. Aerith killer. The Aerith killer. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> Ay, ay, ay. Alright, off top switching to Ike. Alright, let's see. 
So we've got Terry versus Ike. So maybe the strategy is also the matchup mix-up. Up top is three. Three different me. <laughs> well, I mean, yes. What do you mean? Like, he chose three different characters. You know, the, the Ike, the Kali, and the Sephiroth. Pretty interesting. I remember when Ike and Kali used to be really popular. Well, I guess Kali's still popular. Kali's still popular. In the most recent uh, PD stats, uh, above 50. Above 50 entrants every tourney. Uh, probably was the most popular. Second popular is Aegis. Damn, that's great. <laughs> or second most popular winner, rather, I should say. Oh, winner, I got second, it. Second, second, <laughs> of the winners. Of the winners. Of the winners. Folly was the most popular. Makes sense. Oh, of course. Dang. Terry's a heavy boy, and they were on the other side of the stage. So what do you do about this? Oh, good roll in. Oh, buddy. Can convert off the down tilts, but mm. he's still, still in this. So in this has got the go. It's not as good as Sephiroth. It is that. not. <laughs> <laughs> well, it's it's for 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 those purposes. No, 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 yes. I would argue for most purposes, mm. personally. <laughs> like all the shield. Um. Oh, Terry's quite far. Can he make it back? No, no, no. It's not. It's way under the bench. Oh my, way below the bench. Pretty insane of a Sephiroth. Ooh, oh. SDI. Maybe he shouldn't have said that earlier. Said. Or... Ooh. <laughs> no, 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 no. I'm sure he knew. <laughs> I assume. It was just that one time he didn't SDI. Yeah, that's the truth. Oh, SDI. Alright. So we'll wait for Scent on Octop as Ike. Yeah, actually, I feel like Ike should, isn't that heavy. I feel like. I mean, he's heavy, but yeah, not, not that heavy. Well, then let's struggling a little here to close out the stock. It's, it's gonna pay a lot for that. Mm -hmm. But with Terry, you got go. There you go. And you go. And <laughs> there you go. There you go. There well, you go. That was, go. That was just right tackle. That's that was, so was the rising tackle. But now he's got the sauce for this second stock. And the percentage is gonna Whoa. climb real fast. Those combo 57%. Oh, Aether! Shield strings. <laughs> The block strings, rather. <laughs> the block strings. Alright, he's gonna make it back to stage just fine. Power oh, done. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and then... From there? Uh -oh, oh, everyone's gone. playing real careful here. Yeah, for, re for good reason. For good reason. No, absolutely. Like, next hit. Next oh, oh, that was a... That's it. That was a... Yeah, gotta be careful with that hit now on shield. It's the equivalent of people being panicky and using dash attack, except... Terry has like five of them. Yeah, exactly. That's true. <laughs> <laughs> There's just a lot of a lot of, a lot of bursting kill me. Yeah. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Is that a shot? That's a shot. Oh, oh. Whoa, he broke he got the. the... Heat. Yeah. Didn't break it there. Mm -hmm. But yeah, if he got that suicide kill, that would've been a crazy way to end the set. But Power Dox here. Power Dox. Yep. That's it. And it's even, almost. Oh my it's as good as even, really. Oh, as as this matchup. With the Terry comeback mechanic? With this character. <laughs> <laughs> this is the way it is. Alright, if you're not killing him under 100, you're dealing with the go. There you go. And I don't think Ike has that same sauce, unless he just gets an F smash or something. Nope, yeah. The, the range. The rage factor, yes, is not significant, but it is a factor regardless. And the jab, here we go. In the range. Got Can go. you get the kill before he gets into neutral? Ooh, down no. tilt, down tilt! It isn't gonna kill one. though, he's at 80. He was at 70 actually, I think. Power dog, gotcha. oh, sorry, power geyser. Power geyser, back throw! Oh, almost made it. Ooh! Ooh. Oh. Jeez. That was close. And GG's. Good game. Now be a 3 0 from Octa. That was a good game, though. Well, there those are sitting pretty in losers' finals. Yup. So. Yeah, that's, that's, that's the story. And Salmon are both in my pool. That's 2 2 right now. Yeah, fuck. That was hilarious. Mmm. This is now that was hype. I gotta say that was that was quite nice set. The Terry was on it, you know. Just gotta just gotta be careful on the shields. 
But overall, it did list it very well in my opinion. And well, he'll be back, you know, he's just in loser's bracket now. So he'll be waiting in loser's finals to face whoever faces him upon that mount. And then they'll face off once again. Maybe. But Octop sitting pretty comfy in grand finals. You know, he's, he's doing A-OK. -okay. Let's see. Next on the bracket, right now Colin and Fieri are playing now. Simon and Lucas, who are waiting for that matchup to appear. And then JD4 is waiting. So, we still have one, two, three, four, five, six, six players left. Are people ready to set the squash track brackets? Any, any last entrance? Hmm. Hope you're doing all right, chat. Hope you're chilling. <laughs> yeah. yeah. It's nice to be alive. <laughs> if you are not going to play the bracket, nice so you're starting the last break bracket. Basically now, it's, it's, it's pretty cool. It's nice to be alive. I want, I want to talk with chat. How are you guys doing? Uh, it seems that there are some some other Cornellians too. Or Cornell Associates. Oh, that's We're waiting cool. for two sets of losers to finish up. It's like, this one is 2-2. Two, two. One of them is 2-2. Two, two. I don't know what the other one is. The other one, I don't know when it started. Mm. That one should be good soon. Okay. Uh, Gotcha. And after that, we can have JD4 and the winner of Sam and Lucas on stream. Nice! And then we can also start Squad Strikes. <laughs> Alright, awesome. Squad Strikes. That would be pretty cool. But I also want to see, um, I think like... The... CSA is this evening, so... CSA, when is that? It starts at 8. No, no, we'll finish main bracket for the future. Alright, no, that would be cool. Now you gotta get some shumai, bro. <laughs> For squad strikes, let's start with David and Richie on some setup. David and Richie. Where's David? Um, yeah. Alright, so it looks like the squad strike bracket is starting. Oh, that was pretty cool. Hmm. I think I've not helped him too much. I guess I'm. Didn't the curve to me on tired? I might have been. It's been a full day, you know. It's 5 o'clock. We're chilling. I think we've been streaming for about. Four. About 90 minutes now. An hour and 27 minutes. Ooh, they're playing. Alright, let's see. So it is Lucas and JD4. Let's go. Lucas versus JD4. I wonder if Lucas plays Lucas. Uh, Alright, so this is losers round 5 or um uh, let's see, losers semi. Or it's kinda of weird how the brackets are. We'll just call it We'll call it loser semis part one. Yeah. Loser semis part one. There we go. I do wonder which characters are going to pick up. You're doing hand warmer first. Uh, hand warmers? Let's go. I love hand warmers. You love hand warmers? I do. Oh, wait, you guys didn't pick your controls. You're hand warming on the, oh, yeah. the controls. Three, two, one, yeah. They're, they're, they're just warming up their hands. Just <laughs> okay, they're, they're, they're warming up anyway. That's all good. That's 
pretty comfy. More likely gonna see... What is it? Mewtwo and Wolf. I'll be pretty happy. Oh, yeah, Alright, I guess I'll read my probability. Derived distributions. In this section, we consider functions y to be equal to g of x. Oh, no, nope, they're for <laughs> We'll read later. Alright, so we've got Lucas versus JD4. Let's go. Oh, they didn't change their, yeah, they didn't change their tags once again. So they're about to get into it, but they gotta change the controls. So once they finish changing the controls, then they're gonna be gaming. You know. So we'll wait for them to set up the controls once again. Huh, so I would have been able to. I would have been able to read the probability. <laughs> Alright, they're doing it again. They've got the right tags. You know. Oh, that's good. Alright, here we go. We've got Lucas versus JD4. They keep switching the domain because player one supports the buffer. That's okay, I'll just stress that. <laughs> Alright. Oh yeah, chat. Oh, people are really chatting. Let's see how chat's doing. Uh, yeah, I got an NZKZFF at the bottom of the chat. Yeah, Curly, Curly W, we were in the 4th floor of Phillips Hall in 407. Four, or no, 403, sorry, not 407, people are upsetting me. But we're in 403, Phillips Hall. We're all chilling here, playing Smash Bros. You should join if, if you're on campus. Cool. But Lucas versus JD4, we've got Mewtwo versus Wolf right now. Right now it seems that JD4 is ahead in the percentage, but the stocks are equal. No wait, it's actually never mind. The tags are confusing. Alright, hold on. Alright, hold on. So it's actually JD4 who's playing Mewtwo. If I've got the tags right. Okay, there we go. But then the camera positions are swapped. Yeah, that's kind of confusing. But that's okay. <laughs> So JD4 versus Lucas, PS2, a very high percent, last stock, back air from Wolf is going to take it, so Lucas is going to move ahead, JD4 is going to want to take that stock as soon as he can, we got Nair into up tilt, into up tilt, into up air, or I think that was up there. that was pretty nifty I had to say, good Mewtwo combo, dash attack, into forward air, into whoa, that was a clash between up and down air. It's like down air one up there. The back air from Wolf. We two get caught by the laser. Grab from Wolf, down throw, into laser. Going for the back air. Ooh, spot dodges the up tilt. And now Michi's in big trouble. Gets the pulls an F smash out of there, completely reversing the situation. Gets the Shadow Ball. Ooh, maybe he did F Smash instead. 
<laughs> that was close. And so then we will take it there. So here we go. So Lucas will take game number one. I'm right here. <laughs> All right, here we go. Oh, was I about to see a Marv pick from JD4? That would be All right, so Lucas is gonna stick with the wolf. JD4 is gonna play King K. Rule. What a neat character. All right, and they're going to smash Bill. This is the first time we're seeing this stage all day. Everybody, oh, Futsu. Oh, everybody just picks PS2. Small battlefield and Hollow Bastion. Perfectly good stages that I too would pick, but you know, Animal Crossing's nice. Although I feel like for the higher levels of competitive Smash, it's then uh, then that's reversed. It's all Animal Crossing, you know, because people like Town and City, and Smash you know, and all that. Pretty interesting how the game evolved at different levels and over time. But regardless, we have King K. Rule versus Wolf for third stop. Right now. Oh, the Nair. Corner. The Nair. We're back on stage. It's a shield from the Nair. Down to the Nair. Wolf gets the grab. Down throw. Ooh, King K. Rule back throw. And that's it. That's gonna be the first stop. Ooh, but that up smash from Wolf. Very active. Lingers much. And, you know, King K. Rule trying to do as much extra credit. Ooh, back throw, but that's not gonna kill even at 190%. That's wild. Ooh, reflecting the crown. Ooh, nice. Forward air, down, oh not that, forward throw, ooh into the cannonball, gets the throw, berries, oh that was close but still gets the down smash though, dang and so right now J JD4 is just feeling himself, oh but he gets caught by the back air, okay. you know he's, he's not out of the woods yet but the, the King K roll has definitely been a good turnaround for him, ooh, the back air. Like a down tilt, down smash. He's just throwing the kitchen sink and it's working. <laughs> Let's see. Down throw into forward tilt, and that's gonna do it. What a dominant display by Holy cow. Oh, King K. Rule really doing it for him. Oh, we got alumnus in chat. That's 30 cool. An alumni. Early W. Welcome. Man, it's been 10 years. Wow. Uh, they haven't been over in a decade. Yeah, well, feel free to stop by. I think homecoming's every October, right? I know, like, homecoming has even the same. It's like over the like, a month. Stop by, like, anytime. We're, we're here every week. <laughs> Are you part of the Discord? You should, you should join the Discord if you're not. Huh. Did, did he pick random or? Oh, really? Yeah, I skipped the 10 year stuff though. That's it. Is there a 10 year anniversary for Cornell alum? I didn't know. It just feels like another laundry of uh, money machine <laughs> for school uses. Oh my goodness. But here we go. We've got Bowser. Versus Dark Pit. Gotta pay more attention. It's currently 1 1. The Bowser. Really using the up the Oh my goodness. And then that forward air. One of the best forward airs in this game. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. The F Smash is gonna cover ledge. And so that's gonna be an even stop for both of them. Holy cow. All right, there. Oh, yo! Oh, the score is currently 1-1. One, one. So they are going 1-1. One, one. Currently game three, best of five. 
Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Pretty hype set. Oh, F smash. Bowser F smash. Uh oh. Flames. The dash dancing gets caught by the up smash. Oh, I thought I saw critical sparks there, but he didn't fly. <laughs> That was like, oh no, dare air dodge. Uh oh, and gets caught by the side beat. Man, that's, that sucks. It's like where an air dodge will cost you like a stop. It's not stuff. Alright, back throw. Nair? Nair? Down beat? <laughs> that was just the custom combo right there. But the down beat though. Alright, forward tilt. Flames. Oh, doesn't get the side view though. Oh my goodness, going for the Bowser spike. And that's gonna be game 3. <laughs> oh my goodness. That's gonna be game 3 for JD4. That was. That was pretty insane. That was. Yeah, no, that was wild. All right, JD4, one game away. So, wonder who's gonna pick now. Will Lucas still stay with? He is gonna play Kirby, right? All right. So Lucas is gonna stay with the Dark Pit. Alright. So we've got Kirby versus Dark Pit. Here we go. So I wonder if he's maybe Ford trying to flex her. Does he believe in the Kirby? Oh, inhale! Nice, that's a nice sum up. I forget what the article is called, you know, like the thing that he's wearing on his head. The wreath. Or the heart. I, I, I don't know to be honest, but it's pretty cool. Looks good on Kirby. Yeah, the dark wings. The down tilt sending places at this percent. Wow, got the nair. The dare. But that's not gonna edge guard dark pit, but the up smash will. My goodness. Yeah, dark pit's gotta be living to those high percentage. Oh my goodness, what is this blender? And he's back on the ledge. Oh my goodness. It's a pretty incredible wash around. I thought I was watching you know, like J-Jaw J-Jaw for a second. The down tilt got the trip. The dark pit answers right back. It's caught by four tilt. Alright, forward air. Down tilt. And yeah, JD4 is being incredibly aggressive as the Kirby, you know, just linking all of these moves together very well. Oh, he got spiked! And he got spiked again! Oh my goodness! So it got caught by the upbeat. Used the, the super armor, saved him from the first hit. But he got caught by the spike hip hop. And then the physical spike of the down air was enough. Not too wild. Holy cow. Oh, but the revenge spike by Lucas. There we go. Now it's gonna be one stock to two. We still got this thing. Alright. Uh oh. The power of flight. No! <laughs> and it's one stock to one. You know, JD4, he wanted it, but it's gonna cost him. So now it's Lucas gonna take it back with the dark pit. Alright. Down throw into up smash. He's choosing the arrow, but gets caught by the nair. Power of flight. Shields, F smash. Back throw. Forward air. Forward air. <laughs> Ooh, the arrows. Forward air. Oh, he's going deep for that. Oh, the dare onto stage. Dodges the rocks. Gets the dash attack. Uses the arrow. Ooh, JD4 with great spacing on that forward air, back air on stage, and that's going to be the game. 
incredibly incredible display from JD Cole. That was incredible. But Lucas ain't no slouch. That was a great game. So let's see if I look at the bracket. I believe that's going to be. Is that going to be fifth place? Yeah, so that's going to be fifth place for Lucas. So good job to him. Oh, wait, I don't know if we're doing it now. But that was pretty hype, I have to say. That was pretty cool. The Kirby, the Kirby was on point. Mm -hmm. That was that was the long point. I, I appreciate it a lot. The drippiest Smash player for sure. MBG five five two. I'd like to see him around one time. One of these things. What character does he play? <laughs> All right, so it looks like JD4 versus Colin. In, with, oh, that's actually insane. This is the first time they've played in bracket. So, Colin versus JD4 in. Losers round six, so it's our winners semi. It's our loser semi semis. Loser semis part two. There we go. All right, Colin is on the stage. So I wonder who he's gonna play. I assume he's gonna play Cloud, but he could play. But as Octop was saying, you can play like Wario, DDD. Pretty much up to him. Hmm. Well, they're adding names to the Switch. I sure hope my Switch doesn't. The important names don't get deleted. <laughs> No. Okay. <laughs> All right. They're, they're deleting their names. I wonder which names have been lost. Hmm. Scared to think about. I'll have to check later. <laughs> Yeah, I'm not, 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 I'm if possible. If it's not, then it's fine. <laughs> there we go. We're no longer confusing our, our friends at home. Ooh, Cloud versus Wii Fit Trainer. Let's go. Loser semis. Best of five. They're playing video games right now. Hey, what was it? Two one. Oh, two one. Oh, I am not To. Ah, uh, who is To? Uh, yeah. Hey, let's go. Let's go, Salmon To. <laughs> All right, bet. All right, but our boy Bola just went two one in the squad strikes. So that's pretty awesome. This is the good news. All right. Oh, limit cross slash at ledge, and that's gonna be the first stop. Yep. 
Falling on fire, J4 refit. I wonder how this match is going to go. God with a big fish point. Ooh, that up smash from Wii Fit. On point. Alright, cool tilt. Oh, goes for the dare. Hope he doesn't die for that one. Ooh. Alright. There, so <laughs> neutral view into forward air. F smash in neutral. The ledge using the side B ledge jump. I didn't know you fit could do that. Oh, that's a trade. Not one in cloud favor. On ledge. Coast to coast. Back on stage. But can he land? He can land. There we go. Now they're playing left two stocks. Ooh, he did the climb hazard, but the wrong way. Sometimes the cross up happens. Ooh, this the power, the power of the sun. The limit cross slash once again coming into play, and that's gonna take the stop. Ooh, the forward. Uh -oh. oh no, he didn't hit ledge. That was tragic. But the stocks are now even. So I wonder who will take the first game now then. Ooh, jumping over that sunny projectile. Alright, there. Ooh, back air. Ooh! Alright, if it will make it back just fine though. But the limit. Is it gonna be a cross slot? Uh oh, now he has to do it. Or he has to use the climb hazard. There you go. Oh, cross slot or <laughs> climb hazard coming out? Oh, I'm close to the second yeah. Climb hazard again, there's no way. Alright, back one ledge. Goes in, all oh, landing gets caught by F smash. So JD4 is going to take the Uno Uno with We Fit Torim. I wish I had some water. Water would be good right now. I hope you're staying hydrated, chat. Oh, he's switching to Larry. Larry Koopa. Yeah. Oh, Bowser Jr. it is. Larry Koopa. Isn't that crazy how they do like eight different features in this game? It's pretty hype. They didn't have to do that, but they did. All of Bowser's children. Oh my goodness! Wow, that's off when it's really fast. 30 seconds in. Oh, double fair. There. Into B. Into back air. Into back air. And forward tilt. Forward air. Throws up the bomb. Attempts to catch the landing with upside. Machine gun blue! Just out of range for the limit to go up and it's up for the cross lap. Ooh, the Nair. So it escapes the forward smash and gets the Spargo back here. On ledge. That's pretty nice. Ooh, limit cross lap. Oh my goodness. Whoa, did he fall out of the F smash? On the platform? Oh my goodness. And then the forward air spike. Ay, ay, ay. Larry Koopa is not going to make it back to stage. The crowd goes. Limit cross slash. That's quick 30%. Gets the back air. Explodes but survives it, but not in the tongue. I didn't call it. Oh, 
Oops, let me cross that. Or not, let me cross the five hazard. I'm so tired, yeah. <laughs> okay. That's where one of five brackets is set. <laughs> Is it there? Uh, there, uh, back here. I probably need to have a lot more care and strength to get to the first one. Find out it's so pretty obvious. Just look to see him grow. Oh, it's not that bad. Uh oh. Ghost Goes to the corner almost twice. Oh my goodness, and he doesn't make it back to that. No, Mac the hands, because you know, you want to stay as far away from the potential for box, but at the same time, you have to clip ledge. That's a tough thing. Oh yeah. So right now, it is 2 1. Or 2 0. Sorry. 2 0 JD4. Right now, JD4 is, is feeling himself. Uh... Oh, is he playing the Mario? Oh, and Colin's pulling out the DDD. It's a bad time. There we go. So now they're going back to town and city. <laughs> now they're going back to town and city. Colin now has the DDD. You know. Not like. Oh, it wasn't bad, but it might not have been working out, so I think the DVD works out better for him. Calling it the forward tilt. Keep it in there. Oh my goodness, did he catch extreme speed with back air? That's pretty insane. Alright, back air. Mario is getting cleaned up. <laughs> Alright, down to it. Four there. Hmm. Yeah, Colin is throwing out a lot better pokes now. And even using the Gordo as well as the good projectile that it is until it gets F smashed back to you with Lucario Rage Aura Bonus. That's actually pretty crazy. Uh oh. Smash attack. Ooh, the absolute Kyo up smash. Oh my goodness. He's really taking this back. Oh. I'm calling using the inhale. Alright, down to it by Colin. Alright, that's up. I'm so tired. <laughs> Alright. Here we go. There. Into up air. And that's going to do it. Colin will take game number three. So that'll be your first game set. Oh my goodness, JD4. He's not playing random, but he might as well. He might as well. He's playing Donkey Kong. So here they are, two heavies on Hollow Bastion. What is the game plan here? Well, I guess the overall game plan is don't get hit. 
<laughs> in my opponent without getting hurt. That's the name of the game, and I guess that's always been pretty hard. Even more closely defined here, it'll be tough for DDB because he doesn't have a projectile. Or no donkey Kong Yeah, I'm really tired and drowsy. I think I honestly need a nap. But the Smash Bros. is fun to watch. there spike the Gordo onto the edge. The Gordo is not the spot. He's gonna throw another one. And the Gordo is gonna do it. So it seems that the DDD counter pick has been has been doing wonders for Khan. It is now 2-1. Alright, Colin's gonna choose BDB once again. Oh, Jay choose. Oh my goodness, the crowd has egged him on to do it, and now he will do this. JD4 is gonna choose the Lava Plant. Alright, here we go. So, they're going to PS2. Oh my goodness. First stop. That was an incredible technique. So this is interesting. So this is an interesting matchup between BBD and Piranha Plant because now it's the battle of the Tui versus the Gordo. You know, by choosing the like, Piranha Plant, you know, you have a different type of very high damage projectile that. Now at least you can use to answer the Gordo in unique situation. Oh, it looks like that one screwed up. Ooh! And then <laughs> I don't know how to like, what kind of edge? Guarding is <laughs> it's spontaneous, but it's worked well for him. It's two 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 stops to one. Hey, 
Ready? Where's Crash? Now it is the last stock scenario. Forward throw. Oh, the cancel between the Dewey and down tilt. And that's gonna do it. So Conlin able to reverse 3 0 using BDD. Oh my goodness. That was an incredible match. That was a good match, but I was really tired, so I was like facing through. But you guys are like. Yeah. This is uh, Rex. Whose cupcakes are those? <laughs> okay. I'm just eyeing them, that's all. <laughs> Sorry. Okay. Let's see. I'm gonna put my head down for a bit. Maybe I shouldn't. Hmm. I'm not too sure what I want. I'd like to sleep, but maybe if someone could get me. Oh, that's okay. Well, regardless, we've got Colin and Daedalus. So this is now losers finals. The winner of this match is gonna get to face off. Um, is gonna go face um Octop when he gets back from squad strikes. So that's gonna be pretty hyped to watch. Here we go. Update reset the scores. And we're going. Alright, Colin versus Davis. So Davis using the power dunk. Oh shielding the limit cross slash. Nair, 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 side. <laughs> oh, the ball. He, he's, he's got comeback factor. But the both of these are DLC characters that have comeback factors. Except Limit, though, is more like. Green. But I don't know though. Is it though? It's pretty interesting. Oh, that might have been a punish. No, but you can't punish them across that shit. Or it's really hard to. Oh, it was uh, JD 3 2. Yeah. Alright, so then this is going to lose stock first. But he's got a big clock stock soon to so stay competitive. Oh, he got me. Hey, oh my goodness. In the rush. Inside. And that's gonna take the stock. Oh, it's a upbeat. Oh, come back. Okay. Back throw. Oh, time hazard. And now he's got limit. And he threw the blade beam and he got it. Oh, that was hype. He got the blade beam right there. Oh. Move down to it. Oh, that Nair. Is Cloud gonna make it back? But Cloud will make it back. Great piloting by Colin, but 
the dash attack. That's gonna do it. I'm gonna carry. Bring me to the top rope, but I'm not gonna kill at this percent. The last stock scenario. <laughs> Back here from Colin. Back. Ooh, and the spike. That's gonna be game one for Colin. Oh, I'm going to put my head through the and then I'll hear the rumbling end. It'll be cool. with the wave landing. <laughs> That's always cool to see. There's a boom beside you. That's a fourth. Uh oh, I think a lot of the flame must have gotten inside the earbuds. They're not working anymore. That's pretty unfortunate. I had to get new earbuds now. It's all caked in there. That is somewhat unfortunate. <laughs> Alright, so now, first stop is the match. They are, they are going all in, it's at 168%. Anything will do it at this point. Dash attack almost, but good DI from Kong. Colin using the up air, another up air, the damage starting to add up. Ooh, oh, the up smash! The switch throw will do it! Down throw, almost doing it. Or is it up? I, I, I don't know, to be honest. Alright, over there. It was like stock. High percentage stock. Dash attack, and that's gonna do it at that percent. <laughs> and then he immediately counters with, I believe that was back here, back here and there. Good coverage. Oh, we got the low percent on that first one. Oh, side view. It's an up view. It's in there. It's a side view. Hey, Octa, welcome. Hey, winner of this. Yes, that you do. So right now they are they are slugging. Colin nearly took game one. So they are now playing the second game in this best of five. Yeah, well, so I'm really tired, so. I think so, you've been on, on commentary all day. Yeah. <laughs> uh, it's, it's all good, huh? Guess I should drink water and get some sleep and take a shower or something. Yep. And then after, after Holly, you're definitely, definitely gonna wanna shower. <laughs> That's for sure. I, I think. I wanna stay uh, uh, that colorful for, for the rest of the day. <laughs> there you go, honestly, yeah. I think uh, that the uh, play might have broke my earbuds too. It's like it went inside, or I'm, I'm not hearing anything from them anymore. Oh. Maybe I've, I've just lost. Maybe I now have selective hearing, and your voice just permeates 
<laughs> yeah, it's definitely uh, definitely not ideal. But it's not ideal. I don't know how you avoid getting getting that into your ears or like any play. Like, if you're trying to avoid a specific spot, you just have to cover it. Yeah, honestly, that's the thing. I don't think anyone thinks. Oh, I have to cover my ears. Like, cover my ears. Yeah, exactly. From all, well, all like the paint and stuff. From all the paint. There you go. Honestly. Also, do you know whose cupcakes those are? I do not. Okay. Someone brought cupcakes and they look at me. But it'd be a shame to just eat some of the cupcakes without. Yeah. If we if I don't figure know. it out, I'm gonna ask for one. <laughs> Yo, I, I would like to ask for one too. Oh, Mr. Let's see how it's going. It's already on last stop. Right now, Daedalus seems to be taking the lead. And now, our guys are not the guys. They're not the guys. Oh, do you hit in there? The dash attack? Oh, the area the dash attack. Oh, yeah. Get this leg trap. Goes past. Oh, it's gonna have to burn the leg. Oh, dash attack. Now it's gonna take it. It's almost two minutes there. That was a... Yeah, it's a bit of The game's are Yeah, no, these games are right. <laughs> so it's 1-1, one, one. okay. It's 1-1. One, one. Holly versus David, so... I think Colin's probably gonna stay on Cloud if I had to guess. I, I don't would, think I would assume. I don't think anyone's anything <laughs> prompting him to switch to DDD unless he wanted to experiment with it. Yeah. DDD and and Wario, like they're they're decent, but I don't think they're ideal against Terry. Mm -hmm. Maybe make DDD work, or, but I think I feel like Wario against Terry. Is, like, it's not, I don't think it's a bad matchup per se. I just think it's very annoying. I feel like Cloud is um, easier to play. That's fair. Even it's not necessarily a better match. Mm, like the effort in terms of piloting. <laughs> yeah, or like how how like um, how it makes sense to do counterplay against specific options. Like Cloud is very clear. Like against Terry, you're gonna want to space him out with the sword. You're gonna want to double him very low with up airs and up tilts, right? Because Terry can struggle to land, but as Wario, it's a bit harder because they can hit, like Terry can contest Wario's boxes a lot easier. Thanks. Oh, obviously cross slash. Yeah, nice job. Yeah, just run off. Shy B, jump back. <laughs> hard days work. <laughs> yeah, really hard power down. He up is three jab. The the full up power down is quite good on shield. Yeah. Um, it can be. I'm pretty sure it can be as safe as the plus one on shield. <laughs> that should be full <laughs> Yeah, but in that situation, you can. It's not too hard to avoid um, a power dunk like that. But Han is still able to up e through the pressure. Right? And uh, didn't happen to get reversal for it. Nice and a good care advantage. Oh, he gets the downer on the on their cover. Good step. Turn it again. Not very close. Reset. And. No one to punish the with power bunker. Oh, jab, 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 power gun. Yeah, oh, that's the kill, yeah. The need to kill and yeah, sauce. Man, they don't seem to be doing this all day. Exactly, see, that's exactly, the, that's exactly what you do against the other guy. You pull up power gun. Just up. You have a big sword like clouds, it's just that simple. I think the edge guard on carries up to the ledge is actually surprisingly difficult for those that are because it's an instant. So you can just, yeah, just start are. straight through the three buster so far. Yeah, we can go to Wolfie. But if it's not. <laughs> well, yeah, it works here, so then, it's then not. Then you see that. So that's the case back here. Er, yeah, back here, cross slash. 336. I think he expected um, the list to. Jump out with Rock Shield and get a free end of the but I think it punched for it. Ooh, Ooh that was Ooh. an air day, but. Okay, so not ready to confirm that. How do you react to it? I would say it's Ooh. Ooh. Okay, I'm gonna play him going right through the, the power wave. Mm -hmm. Gets it there, and then Glee goes down this time, so. Lands it. And the, the spike to the spot, and then get out there. Oh, I'm taking game three. He's accelerating. Yep. Uh, he's eight out of seems it yet. Like I'm gonna, seems like I'm gonna be playing Cloud. We'll see. Ooh. But <laughs> if, if there's any character that can that can make comebacks, it's probably Terry. Go I is, Go is just that that annoying to, to deal with because of how, how strong he can be. Exactly. 
but you do need to land those combo starters to land to convert into those super specials. That's the truth. Same, same characters, and we're going to town. I assume that uh, Daedalus wants to wants a flatter stage, so he can. Uh, he doesn't have to worry about platforms as much. This cloud is a lot more platforms than Daedalus. It's about to be one town and city plan just now. Yeah, imagine that. I wonder why Terry would pick me. Although, yeah, he just said that the other day. I was like, why Terry would pick town and city I can see um, other. I don't know what what column down, but I think town is not a bad pick. I think some of the, the platforms on the side might be able to help. Um, or to them, but we'll see. Oh, 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 I think he might have been able to make it back if he did the if he held the, the button so he would go a bit higher, but not quite sure. Yeah, sometimes like it's extremely short, extremely long, it's like you have to charge it for more. Yeah, and Terry has like four different ways to do the up B, you can do like the short uncharged up B, you can do the long uncharged up B, and then the and then the shorter one with the charge moments. His, his recovery is actually quite tricky. Much variation. Ooh, gets picked up by the climb pass. Cool. That's very nice. Very good kill. That's, that's incredible. Stuff even stops now. Both fair into. Nope. Fair does not connect. Ooh. Now blow it up. Dennis is now is he's now feeling it. <laughs> oh yeah. Oh. So when you get hit by climb hazard there, a lot of a lot of players will try to either carry it or just shield it, but it's so safe on shield that sometimes the best option is to hold oh, that, that nice spike from home. But if you get hit by climb hazard sometimes on shield, and sometimes the best option is to spot dodge the landing hit or to roll away. It's a uh, not the most intuitive option to do, but it usually ends up in a, in a more favorable reward. Okay. Especially like spot dodging for those lingering moves, so say like maybe Yoshi down B. Yep, or something, even something like uh, Young Link or Toon Link up B on shield. It's, it's a multi hit, so it's hard to, hard to, uh, time, like hard to like, parry it if you want to try and parry it, and it's pretty safe if they just get on shield. So spot dodging last hit can probably be their bigger thing. Colin's still living. Still living. Banging in there. 150. Oh, this is the plan. I think an up smash would have been there, but I think he tried to do like an up air and got hit by the top. Oh, that's right. So. The rest of Colin Wario still alive. You my head. Yeah. We haven't seen any any Wario fighting yet, but. You know, the cloud has been doing him very yeah, well. Maybe maybe the Clown Warrior will show up in in the grand if he takes this set. There he goes. There's still a chance. Absolutely. He can uh for you. But it's looking somewhat grim for Daedalus. He's not doing this. Yeah, I mean it's, it's not back impossible. To, back but to stage. He has the range to do it. But cross slash! That's it. Oh he gets picked up on the top. Okay, so it's gonna be 3 1 for Clown. And I will see Colin in, uh, in Grand in, in, in Grand Finals, well, have fun! Alright. Congratulations. <laughs> Alright, that was Colin versus Daedalus, so Colin will take game one for or Colin will, Colin will take winner and loser's finals and we'll now go on to grand finals on the loser's side to challenge Octop. So that's going to be pretty hype. So now we now have Colin versus Octop. Okay. Oh yeah, Colin, move a little bit to your right to be in the frame. Yeah, there you go. You're good now. You're now in frame. Alright, now I will hit the grand finals button. Ooh. So now we've got Colin versus Octop. 
Yeah. So this is your warm up program. Alright. Alright. So we've got the Cloud versus the Sephiroth. Let's go! So, Colin versus Off Top. Cloud versus. Yeah. Wow. Man, how in the world is this gonna go? So it seems. Oh, this is like a whole Final Fantasy match. Wouldn't it be cool if they could go to um? Uh, I forget what Zephyrom stage is named, but that'd be pretty cool. But they're on PS2. You know, I love canonical matches like this. You know, will we'll Colin be able to? Overcome like seed placement, and defeat the, the super soldier. Although, Colin, although Bob's also super soldier, I, I don't know. Although I didn't play Final Fantasy VII, though. just influenced by Evan. But they're going. Currently, the third salt. Ooh, and the Eftos gonna pick up that get up on that stock. But the up smash clapping right back. Now it's two stocks to two stocks. Grand Finals, Colin versus Octop. It's gonna be incredibly hype. So we've got up tilt. Ooh, parries the fair. Back throw into back air. Gets the forward air. Uses the limit climb hazard. But he's gonna get caught. It's tough, you know, to recover against a big sword. But they both have big swords. Just one is bigger than the other. So it makes getting in kinda of hard. But that's okay though. I've got this. You know, just how to play good neutral. Right? Oh, Zebra back row? Up to a narrow dodge by Colin right there. Alright, he's fishing. He's fishing. He got the nair. Oh, Clan Hazard gets the after hit. It's the middle hip off. Ooh, almost got that back air there. Oh, off top got to get the up throw slash, and he goes off stage for it. Why not? You know, you can do it. Go ahead, you can seal it right there, right then. There you go. That's gonna be game one for Octop in our grand finals. So now in this best of five, Octop only needs to win two more, and he's, he'll be he'll be pretty chill. Do you mind if we hop on? Hey, welcome back! <laughs> welcome back! It's Wavy and the crew. How are you guys doing? We're good. How are you? And doing it. Okay. Life is good. We are watching some top tiers play. We're watching. Who did Octop go game one? Ooh, off top went Sephiroth game one. He's going to call now. Mmm, yep, now he's going. Oh yeah, call him, yeah, he went for. Now he went uh, going Palutena. So Sephiroth to Palutena. Ooh, ESC said Colin hit him more. I hope you heard that, Colin. You know, I mean, he's doing it right now. That's, uh, that's true, though. Oh, they're going to limit cross slashes. He's gonna go for it. Oh, back air. And the Spargo back air. Ooh, into Nair? We into backwards up. That's something that Chag does. He has to teleport to the platforms on PS2 a lot, and then he gets kind of burnt for it. Yeah, that's true. That's it, but it's some smooth bit though. It's like smooth. The get up. Or the get up on the. Uh, the get up cross slash, actually. Oh, it's not bad. Or, no, it's not. And then blew up the Yeah. Blew up the. Blew up the. Spargo's doing a lot of that at Genesis. <laughs> this is a good move though. Great out of gym option. Great get up from ledge option too, I guess. Oh, forward throw. Oh, he's still gonna get caught by this. Oh, yes, he is. How do you stop? And then go hit with your goal. Face him out with your bear. Has he? <laughs> Here you go. <laughs> Mid set coaching? It's mid literal mid set coaching. Colin hit him more. Don't get hit. <laughs> Here you go. Oh, stop. Oh, man. A lot of stairs there. Oh, but the climb hazard. 
Now this is an intense second stock. They're going back and forth. Yeah, he's brought this back. Alright. Oh, the flare. Oh, but landing up there. Falling up there as a smash four. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> Oh, the Nair into the up tilt conversion. Yeah, that's it's gonna pull. That's pretty wild. Oh. Wow. Because, like, you drive down with the Nair. And then... Okay. Oh, man, will he be able to land? Right now. Oh, oh, oh the F smash. Get and gets the drag oh. down there. Gonna get back on stage with the Nair. Alright. Yeah, he wants to oh, the limit. Yeah. Oh, but Palutena forward air. Being above Palu just it. sucks. Because up air, and then your shield is invincible, so just dash attack and anti air. It's just like absurd. There we go. So that's game two for Octop. <laughs> ESC in the chat is always. Yeah, ESC. ESC is, um, is, is vested. You know. Okay. It's, it's looking kind of tough, though. But. No, you never know. I think yeah. Oh, oh, oh shit! No! <laughs> no. Oh, what is oh, this? Stinky. He's oh. choosing <laughs> Wario. <laughs> They're both playing Wario. What's happening here? Oh goodness. Yeah, Gluto. Good job. Wait, so which that Wario um, So Colin the bike. So Gluto came to Cornell. So this yeah, is Colin's Wario Week Wario. One Wario versus Octop's Wario. Game One Wario. <laughs> there we go. In Grand Finals, <laughs> they're both nearing at each other. Oh my goodness! All right. Oh, the bike! Right before the bike comes, and he's gonna throw the bike, and he's gonna use Down Smash. I don't know. He's backing it up. Yo. Throwing it back. Throwing it back. All right. Both have utilized their bikes. One is dressed properly for said biking, one is not. But that's okay. <laughs> that's true, but you need like the safety gear, such as the goggles, exactly. and then accessory jacket. <laughs> yeah, <an> accessory jacket. <laughs> <laughs> accessory <laughs> jacket. <laughs> both hitting the bike. Leaving <laughs> the bike. Alright, the post back throw. Can Wario get up? Can he pick up the other person's bike and ride on it? Ooh, that's a good question. Right? Is that how yeah, it works? Uh, Colin's telling me in the middle of the set. Oh, oh my, God. my goodness. <laughs> <laughs> Colin's really talking in the middle of the set. <laughs> it, would be, it would be a great experiment. Maybe maybe they could, you know, while Gentleman. while they're while they're gentlemen in grand yeah, have a gentleman in grand finals where they exchange bikes. Ooh, but that backer from up top is gonna take the first stop of this match. But then a revenge back air from Colin. Will up top return? No. Oh, he will not. Yeah, you got pineapple. Oh, I PS2. Yeah, pineapple. I see some people are at the walk that's going on. Uh oh! Uh oh, they're glowing. I, I just worry He's about. These two sucks, by the way. Uh, that's subliminal messaging. PS2 is great. Why would you say that? PS2 is PS2 is like the FB of this game. That's my opinion. What does that mean? People fucking hate FB in melee. Yeah, but like it's it's important stage. It's the things where good things, important things take place. Neutral green wide stadium stage. Yeah, the two platforms. But, but that's, yeah. that's 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 my. I'm opinion. waiting to call that. Um, what? Regardless, to right now they both have to... fully charged walk, but they're playing neutral. So right now the bike's going on. No double bike hit. <laughs> uh -oh. Forward throw. Up top now edge guarding. All right, gets the up air. Almost oh, gets up left foot. We're not gonna see walks from. I feel like. Yeah, I agree. <laughs> oh, the roll! So Colin meant to catch the roll with the F tilt, but then he rolled past him and caught him with the F tilt. Right, whoever got the behind first. him and got him with the whoever back hits air. the person first. Okay. So now this is the last stock. Both have fully charged walk now. So now whoever gets whoever labbed and got the up air combos 
at this percent <laughs> is now gonna be able to use an exciting buff <gasps> that is flip worthy. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, trigger. oh man, this is tough. Oh, it's oh he that's took a game. It. He took there a game. we go. So the Colin Wario, you know, pulling. Wow, that's that's it right there. That's a game for Colin right there. The Wario debut. We have one week of Wario. This is it. And a week is longer than a game, folks. That's the takeaway. A week is indeed <laughs> longer than a game. He did? Oh, well, they ready to go. He wanted to honor him. Is he in Squad Strike? I don't know. Alright, so Colin appears to be sticking with the Wario. Oh no, we've got some snake representation this week. You know, shout outs to Z, out who Z. is not here currently, but would likely be in the grand finals if he was. But it's it's all good. You know, Octop is Octop is pulling the grenade pins for him in this match. On PS2. Game four. <laughs> But the up airs are on point from Colin to Wario. Wario doing it okay. Hey, Wario, can you please? Uh, can he? Won't it blow up? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. See the face? The up smash? And the bombs? In there. Uh oh. Where's he gonna throw him? Okay, he didn't attack right. Yeah. That's good. Ooh. Grabs the grenade. He wants the rage. Uh, <laughs> he wants the rage. There we go. Alright. The aerial. Ooh! Just don't drop it. The snake up tilt is gonna catch it. And then. Dash attack. Just dash attack again. Ooh, that back here. The Wario back here is gonna even out the stocks. Right, stick right there to dash attack. Um, I think he's gonna. So the way Wario works is that if you're winning, you're actually tied. Dash attack. And if you're, <laughs> and, if you're right, yeah. and if you're tied, you're losing. That's yeah, well said. <laughs> yeah, no, that's the truth. Ooh. So if if Colin gets a fat little walk on there. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Oh, that was a nice C4 tech chase. Crap thing. He is yeah. played sick. You do anything to put not his main. <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> Z's in chat. Oh, Z's in chat? Oh! It just came back, and now I'm glad I did it! <laughs> I'm glad you're back as well, Z. Yeah. The, the, this is the he didn't miss too much. He just the this is the snake representation right here. It's just pretty hype. Look, he's doing all the grenade things that you do, and the C4 where it's placed and it's just like oh my goodness, there's the walk, but it's not gonna kill. So now he's gotta wait like three minutes for it to come back. Man. Uh oh, the, the, no, no, the C4. What was he gonna do? How does, how does he navigate this? When does now? When will he hit the button? Oh, okay. The C4 is on. The C4 is not on him anymore. Uh, he has used his walk, so. so. So he's gotta wait, or he's gotta stall long enough to get walked again, but. You know, I'm sure. Uh oh. Don't roll back. It can still kill without it, most definitely. Nice little back here. Yup. Ooh, C4! That's yeah. gonna do it, along with the bike. So that's gonna be... Octop is gonna take Grand Finals. Okay, now I have to play him in squad strike. Right? There you go. Alright, and so now they're doing cash distributions because we have a prize pool. Whoa, that's crazy. 
is yeah. Three one. Coach two three one. If my girl and Colin both be drowning and I can only save one, catch me at my girl's funeral screaming. Should have went. Tragic. Oh my goodness. Extended C4 hitbox with the yeah, bike too. That makes sense. Okay, oh I need goodness. I need my controller. Here, anybody want to do some bug finals? I'd like to get one game in before I head up. Do you want to play in? Um, <laughs> oh, no. Here, we can, we can like play a game. It'll be pretty cool. So you're done commentating? Yeah. Is it? I think nice. I'll be done commentating. Well done. Thank you. I Thank you very much. Invested. Stream's not done yet. We can still play video games. Who wants to play a game? I would love to fuck Let's go. Let's go. I do. I mean. We're warm enough. <laughs> or no, I'll, I'll face the second. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>
Finals. Oh boy, that was that was incredible. Oh, <laughs> okay, that was stream. <laughs> I was like, I didn't turn stream off. I was like, all right, well, that was my attempt at fuck finals. Yeah, Octop is good at the video game. He's not able to take stock two on the last one. I was like, first stock when I, and then just snowballs. But you know, adaption. Got to get better at the game. But yeah. For the viewers at home and around the world, thank you for tuning in today. It's pretty cool. Unless you guys want to do one Squatch Strike on stream. Yeah. Mm, sure. I don't care if it's not. I want to do Yeah, I don't care. I don't care. Oh, okay. Nah. Nah, I'm gonna head home. Alright. I'm gonna... Yeah. That's end stream for today. Or well, no, wait. But if I end stream, I'm gonna have to take away the switch. I'll stay for a bit. Let's go. Alright, so I'll get some squad strikes on the telly, so they're going to PS2 for the squad strike 3v3. I do wonder which characters are going to be. Uh, Mario, Link, Hero, Octop, Halu, and Ike. I see, so Octop has been... You know, refreshing all his characters for this squad strike that was gonna take place all throughout Ultimate Singles. <laughs> Pretty interesting how that works. Yo, that is Wade. Pretty cool guy, I have to say. Hey, they are playing the squad strikes. <laughs> Yo. Oh yeah, I'm gonna head out after this match. But thank you guys.
Ooh, oh man, the Sephiroth is on a rampage right now. Good hero. Link. Link is here. Ooh, the up B. Nice. He's gonna take it, so now we've got Link versus Power. Oh, no, that's gonna be Yeah, who's Cupcakes? Somebody just brought Cupcakes and then... I've been asking all day. Okay. I would like one. <laughs> Don't worry, it's okay, but if, if you're offering, I would like one. They're good. They look good. Nice. Right, that's my quest for cupcakes. Right. <laughs> but meanwhile, we've got. The oh my goodness! He got caught by the up smash due to the bomb projectile. Shoot. Interesting how that works. Oh, Maggie? Ooh, down through. Alright, wavy Mario is on the scene. Reverse. Ooh, let's jump back in. Nice. Now Wario versus the Ike. I said Wario, it's Mario. Alright, Mario versus the Ike. Oh, nice neutral jump. Oh, jump neutral air dodge. How to get past such a massive destroy? Uh oh. Oh man. That was like crazy. You turn around ten times. He's mad. He's funny. Hmm. The auto turn around. It's nice. One strike. Mario! Link! Hull! Hero! I'll see Okay, so... Switch now, um, Palutena for the Cloud this time. <clears throat> so, a lot of big swordmen. Elevate this swordman on off the oh, yeah. side. That's just the way it do and be sweet. Oh, okay. You're good, you're good. Here we go. Yo, yo, win. Ooh. So you're playing MD Stone MD Stone? Yes, he's saying to gimp the clown. Is that what he's here playing uh, as I'm sure there's a way to do that. But if he ta oh, let me cross that. Yep, that'll do it. But I'm sure if anybody here can, it's 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 Mr. Mario himself, <laughs> Mr. Wahoo himself. Hmm. Oh. Why is this over here? Oh, because uh, oh the charger? Yeah. Oh yeah, cause just so people would walk over it. <laughs> It'd be going. Gimp the cloud. Gimp the cloud. Oh, <laughs> and it sort of happened. The cloud did not recover. Now we've got Mario versus the Ike once again. Run back. The run back. Uh oh. For the spot dodge. And the Nair, the wall of Nair. And Fair. Oh. Yo, Mario Bear kind of go off. <laughs> Absolutely. 
Let's go to Luke. Oh, he uses it. Oh, he sure uses it. <laughs> he uses it. He sure does. Uh oh, the the ether out of nowhere didn't catch him. Mm -mm. Oh, okay. That was that was a fox snare. Yeah. <laughs> Mario is not gonna quite get that text chase. Oh, there it is. I, I, I don't know what, what yeah what was the, what was the thought process there okay yeah, the, works sometimes we got link on the scene who's his last is it his last Sephiroth? yeah okay be I believe in I believe in the wavy link it's better than the zombie link link <laughs> He threw the arrow! Oh, I think that's the first time I've seen anyone do that ever. That's why. He's picking up the arrow. Oh, he was going for the spike. Alright. Oh, almost got the arrow snipe. The explosion back on ledge. Oh. Oh, wow. well, almost I honestly the... don't know if that would have hit him out of the armor. Probably. Yeah, it's if he had timed it. Maybe yeah. timed it earlier. Uh oh! Boomerang. Boomerang. Kills all your bitches. <laughs> the game went right in time. Right on time. Alright. If no one got me, I know Boomerang got me. <laughs> <laughs> That's all three links, really. All three, all three links got that. That's a thing. Uh, it's a good move. It's an important move to them, too. At least in yeah, like in the Zelda series. <laughs> in this series? <laughs> oh, yeah, in, in this series. I, I mean, Breath of the Wild, I, I don't know. I, don't, I never use Boomerangs, Breath of the Wild. What if I said I've ne I have to play Breath of the Wild? Uh, fine. <laughs> it's a great game. I was uh -oh. a doubter. Oh? Uh oh. He has wing out. It's actually, he brought it back with the Link. The it's Link, is, the link is true. Sephiroth is in danger. Perceived danger. Sephiroth's never in danger. <laughs> well, maybe now he's a little in danger, you know. 120. 120 Funny. against Link. Link's got some pretty good kill power. On, like, every tilt, on every aerial. On a B, oh, but... No, you're smash. living, you're living. Down smash. Wait, doesn't get it. Oh, that no, was... The pickup. <laughs> <laughs> The wavy link goes off. That was pretty good. No, you did well. Yeah, the wavy link went off. Wavy link. Listen, I gotta use it in bracket. Absolutely. I don't know when. Hmm. I don't know what he covers for Mario. <laughs> 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 All right, I'm gonna pack up. So. Yep. I'll pack up. Thank you guys. Thank you, people at home, for watching. Much appreciated. I'll see you all later.